to any of my fellow juicers who might find this audio, I know I'm Pepe Pains. It's not my fault I watch Ludwig. Like the, like, the, like the tires, Ludwig had a good year. Bubbles to kombucha. Let's review the past before we zoom into the future. The YouTube tutor with the few screws loose who does doodos on the competition. T-Fooder, Buddha, Ludwig, king of the Zoomer. Peter knew the doo doo blow up like Vesuvius. TikTok boom. Woo! The stealing from Jeopardy and Family Feud. A Sigma male with that reflection in the scale. Uber, Elwig, Loser. Ludwin. Charmer. Seeking basketball advice to Ghana. Reddit, Karma. Demo, what? Farmer, he goes Where? By leeching off the goats Who call him Chupacabra He know yep. Speaker looking head ass what? I'm dead ass oh. That pample shit's funny For a dollar store steve we know You think the lions would win You're smoking reef Roll the bloopers Lol they've never even been To the Super Bowl Millions a lot. Yeah I got the stupid jokes I'll try to keep them short Like <laughs> tax evader Pimple face And incest baby Excavate him How do you do that With your fingers Premature ejaculation Five foot eight Plus L plus ratio Plus now the hood Watches Aiden Ross the Channing Tatum at Twitch oh, Fuck YouTube I mean YouTube Okay. Oh, what up, boys? How's it going, everybody? Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Oh, check it out. Huh? Look at that. Saikuno sent me some good shit. Dude, I meant to text him. The merch box is pristine. This shit's good. Look at this. That's cute as fuck. It's too warm for the sweatshirt. I think this is so cute. A Polaroid camera. Not a Polaroid. What do you call these? Just an instant camera? This shit's fire. Wait, leaked? I made that myself. Nobody leaked that I leaked. Okay? Nobody's allowed. This doesn't leave the room, all right? All right? Just let's keep it friendly here. Let's keep it friendly. Leak what? I like you that I like that. I like the way you're talking. Anyway, what's up, boys? Welcome back to the stream. Welcome to Toontown Tuesdays. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's go. Uh, we're going to play at least an hour of Toontown today, depending how bad it is. That'll probably be at maybe 5.36 p.m. Pacific time. Got some shit to do before then, including an announcement of sorts. A little announcement. Love the entire Toontown community is currently freaking out that you're playing and we're thinking it's going to be the end of times. Figured I'd let you know. Wait, what do you mean the end of times? It's going to be the end of my stream, not the end of times as a whole. You know, I, I'll tell you what, I'm not looking forward to finding out how, how, how many viewers I have after booting up Toontown. I don't think the Toontown community is large enough, no offense. To fill the hole, the void that will, will that will be that will be created for me playing Toon Town. You're gonna crash the servers, dude. That'd be hype. If we just crash the servers, then I don't have to play Toon Town. Think about it. That's genius. Just let the servers die.
Dude, in Toontown, the villains are the big wig executive CEOs. It's literally you in real life. No. I, I, I'm like the hero. I come in and I save the day with pies. And, um, water spray. You fight corporate robots and that's what you are. No, I'm not. What do you mean? I, how am I? I'm not backed by, like, a big corporation. No, I, I'm... I'm for, for the little man. <laughs> No, wait, my YouTube deal is, that's more of a handshake thing. I wouldn't read into it too much. Another announcement. Another major announcement at 5 p.m. Pacific. That's right, yeah. That's right. That's right. What about that giant Exxon mobile sign in your room? Okay, now nah, we're getting to the specifics. Toontown means you go down to 15 viewers and get rolled by someone when you try and read non-existent chats, right? That's right. Hey, Lud, I think I should play Slime. I could go bald. Hit me up. You know I met him before he was bald, right? You couldn't replace him because he's the funniest person I know, Mango, and I can't imagine you cracking the top 1,000. Did the VOD yesterday get striked? Yeah, every time I play this song. I know, I literally know it's going to happen, so I shouldn't keep doing it, but every time I do this. I, I can't even be doing it right now as like a joke. Because it's, it's literally going to make the VOD get muted and then a banned. It just bans the VOD in every country that, that, like matters in the terms of my audience Keck W still laughing about the TikTok made about you about XQC's offline chat being more hype than here XQCL is that what juicers are doing these days are juicers just on TikTok is that XQC's audience just a bunch of TikTok Andes? Thank you, Aiden, for the five months. Timothy for the five months. Three months running on YouTube. Can't believe it's been so long already. Keep up the great work of Ludwig. Thank you so much, Timothy. I appreciate that. Congrats on 100 Thieves. What do you- wait, what? That's not my announcement. I didn't join 100 Thieves. Are you just saying that because Cutie posted a picture of us where I am wearing the 100 Thieves shirt? Is this why? This is the only damn reason why you could possibly maybe think that. But no, I just wore the shirt because it's like a nice shirt. It's also my initials and the city I live in. Where's the minion costume? I think right there. It's right next to me. Your pants are ripped? Yeah, yeah, they are. Yeah, they are. But here's the thing about jeans. I fit into like dead ass two pairs of jeans total. So, you know, it, I don't care if it's got a rip if I fit in it. It's not hugging my thighs. Major announcement at 5 p.m. PT Pacific Time PT PM PT. What server? I don't think I want to play with you. Like, how about that? How about you figure that out first? Because when I woke up this morning, no part of me wanted to play games with Furry Lover 12352. I'm just going to keep it a stack. I feel like 
you were a bit presumptu pre presumptuous there. Should have backed up a little bit. Asked me if I want to play. Just ask him what server I'm on. Rude. You know? A little icebreaker would be nice. That's furriest. You can't be furriest. It's not a thing. You know what? I, actually, yes. I, I am furriest. I'm a hundred... Because I eat cows. I eat them. I very clearly don't think cows are equal to humans. Otherwise, I wouldn't be eating them. That, like, come on. What do you, I can't lie here. I can't sit here and say to myself, yeah, you know, animals on par. And then be eating them. Got to think about that. Cows don't have fur. Service, right? Since it's not even backed by Disney anymore. Can you let Sauchini into your Fortnite tournament? Are you getting me? Sauchini? Saucony? Saucony? Saucony's nuts? I don't know how you want me to even say this. What's the major announcement? It's at 5 p.m. Pacific time in 13 minutes. Major announcement. I'm so excited for Toontown. This game is my childhood. It was actually a pretty big part of my childhood, too. Okay, I just found out who Sauchini is, and now I don't want Sauchini to enter my tournament. They said, put me in pussy, and then said, I stream, haha, <laughs> quirky. Yeah, I, you know, I don't know if that's it for me. I don't know if that's my vibe here, you know? I, that's a bad precedent to set if you let the guy who calls you a pussy in, because then people are going to be like, oh, that's how I get in. Oh, I call a stranger I don't know online a puss. Right. I should have known. The major announcement is that Fortnite pulled out. They did not pull out. The announcement went swimmingly, and I already created a list of about 60 to 70 names. And I'm right now. I'm I'm having Nick England go through them all to make sure you guys aren't cheating and lying about your average viewership and your Fortnite skills. Wait, you're telling me they got Wordle for Fortnite? Inspired by Wordle, Fortle is a game that you, get, you guess Fortnite-related words. Number one victory royale. Okay, L. Wait, what does purple mean? What does purple mean? Purple means it's in the wrong spot. Okay. Build. Game's fucking easy. It's for kids. Wordle. It's a game like Wordle. I'm thinking of a Pokemon. You have eight guesses. Emoji key. Who's that Pokemon? Try Squirtle daily. All right. Low punny. Holy shit, this is nerdy. <laughs> it's from a higher generation low pony, not the same type, and it's taller and weighs less. <laughs> that's actually kind of weird that it's taller and weighs less, because that's a pretty tall Pokemon. That's very light. It's a very light Pokemon as well. How are you taller and weighs less? And it's a different type. Where it's three feet tall. 
Yeah, but it's also pretty light. The it's the it's the weight I'm worried about. Maybe maybe like um who's that really hot Pokemon? Shit. Someone get there for me. Yeah, Gardevoir. Thank you very much, Blink. <laughs> Uh, wow. I pretty much picked the same exact Pokemon with no new information. Taller and lighter. There's that one grass fucker. Oh my god! Taller? Okay, well actually I went... I went I went down in height, so I can't even be mad. Uh Drift Bloom. Oh, wait a second. This is the tallest motherfucker I've ever seen in my life. It is ghost type, is what that means, right? It is ghost type. A tall ghost type. Dusclops. Or Dusk Noir. Oh, it's it's shorter. Okay. So we know the height is between 1.6 and 2.2. And it's from a higher generation. I should have looked at that. I didn't look at that at all. I don't think I know any... There's the Gothita. Higher gen than Gothita? I don't think I know. Golurk is the new gen. Wait, how how is it possible to be a higher generation than Golurk? Also, what does the check mark mean? It's Golurk is Gen 5. Okay, fair enough. Correct type, but why is this one an X? Type 2 is Ghost. Oh, I see. So it's 100% Ghost something from a late generation. I don't think I know this at all. Dragapult. Okay, yeah, it was... I don't even know what this is. This sounds like a British person saying a word. Blasifalon. I don't... Dude, is this a Pokemon? Straight up, this is a real Pokemon? You're telling me that that comes out of a Pokeball? Dead ass? That's crazy. I can't believe that comes out of a Pokeball. I'm genuinely shocked. <sighs> when are you playing Toontown? Probably 5.36 p.m. PT. We'll start. We have a major announcement at 5 p.m. In about six minutes here. Thank you, Xander, for the three months. Internet Historian reaction when? Oh, I actually forgot. Internet Historian dropped a video. It was when I was on vacation. I actually do want to watch it. Boys. Internet Historian. That zone between area 50 and 52. Everyone and their mother must have watched us on stream, right? Have you seen the video, The Gentleman Pirate? Some of his best work. Internet historians? Possibly. Possibly? Don't remember, though. Hey, Lud. Sent you my Ludwig Monday featuring Fortnite application on Twitter. Hope you saw it. Thank you, Marcus. I'm not sure if I did. I can't remember, but I appreciate that. Thank you, Incendi. I appreciate it. I'll take a look. Ludwig, is the announcement you're getting bone extensions because you're short? Okay. Really? You dropped $10 for that? I, I have to ask. Did you come up with the joke and then send $10? Or did you put the $10 donation in and then think, oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. I need a joke here because I just spent $10 and then came up with it last second. Because if it's anything but the latter... I'm concerned for you. 
play Wizard 101 next? Okay, Jerma's gonna have to beat me at something else, all right? Something he could never beat me at. Battleship for me to go that deep. Toontown is great once you get to the COG bosses, HQs, and new content, even if it's an old MMO. Daniel Kim, thank you for the membership. Ludwig Skin, new announcement? I'm not Valorant. What do you mean, new skin? Try Quirtle. I play Quirtle about every day. I crush Quirtle today. What are happened to Pokemon Legends of Arceus stream? Oh, it's coming. I put it on the promise list. Yeah, no, it's it's coming. Oh, me? I, I, I wouldn't forget. When I say I'm going to do something, I do it. For real. Global is also a good game. You gotta guess the countries. Well, I play world Which is similar, maybe. Perhaps. When's a VTuber skin? I am working on it. The problem is it takes so much effort to animate a chest hole correctly. And that's what they're all working on, you know? We have teams of people. Swaths of human, really, on it. It's not easy. It's not easy. Try framed. It's like Wordle. Dude. It's like Wordle is the new way for people to explain things. It's how you, you people used to relate everything to like, oh yeah, it's like the Uber of massages. And now every game is like, oh yeah, it's just like the Wordle of like uh, body parts. It's the Wordle of porn stars. There's a Wordle of everything. You could go through 30 Wordle games every morning. All different. I'm the only guy left on Wordle. You're like a loser now if you're only playing Wordle. If you're not playing Flirtle or, 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 or Loodle or Quirtle or Squirtle, you're a goddamn idiot. But me, I'm still stuck on my day one Wordle game. Took me six today. Nobody else is playing with me. I show my roommates, they don't give a shit. They're on Commertle. And it just shows a clip of someone coming. They have to guess which porn star. Aiden's pretty proficient at it. All things considered. I think he's the best in the house. Someone's holding it down. <laughs> yes, semen toll. <laughs> yeah, username was taken. Luddle, and it's my YouTube title, or YouTube thumbnail, and you have to guess the title. Now we're talking. Turn on TTS. I don't think I want to, because the last super chat I received said, Try decapitation. It's like Wordle. So, uh, you know. I don't know if I want to try that. They, they ain't wrong. All right, all right, all right. Announcement, announcement. Announcement. $100, that's it? Okay, I'm not getting any of the money. It's going to my mods or a viewer. What do you fucking want from me? Eat shit. <laughs> Oh, Ludwig, what do you mean? Why is it not $1,000? What do you want from me? All I'm doing is going to sit there and mash for like three hours till my arm falls off and you're whining and bitching at me? What do you want? What do you want? I'm not getting any of this. I'm not getting any of this. It's all going to the mods. Blame the mods. They're sucking me dry. I had to revoke my millionaire status because the mods are just taking every last penny I have. It's like that one... Uh, political comic where the rich oil baron is sucking all the oil and then it's me underneath with one loose pipe giving me drops blink 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 and that's all I get that's all I get just drops baby just drops
Is it PS2 controller compatible? <laughs> no, no. No, it's a GameCube. Uh, that's it. It's just a GameCube. I uh, No. Is a GameCube controller adaptable? Now we're talking. Aspen Tree, thank you for the membership. Yeah, we're playing Toontown at some point. Can we get autographs and pictures as well? Probably not at the booth, because that's all that people would come up, and there'd be a line of people doing that, and I'm more focused at the stream, so at the booth, I'll probably have a sign that says, um, uh, do not take a picture of me. I am, I am very important. <laughs> and zero autographs. And it'll be in big Comic Sans letters. Why not donate to charity? Look, the mod's got to eat too, okay? I mean, geez, we did a $100,000 charity drive earlier this year. Poor guys. What's Toontown? It, okay, here's, here's what it is, man. I've been streaming for almost four years now. All right? Three years full-time, almost four years part-time. And one of the first streams that I ever did ever was Toontown. And the only reason I did Toontown is because my chat whined and begged and kvetched. Ludwig, please, play Toontown, please. And so I booted it up. I played a bit of Toontown. I tried out the game. Let me tell you, I used to play Toontown. I liked the game of Toontown a lot. But when I actually booted up and played it, all of my viewers disappeared. Nobody actually came to the stream. And it was so bad that at one point when I looked over to read chat, the only message there was from a member of chat who said, stop looking over at chat. There's no one here. And that was the last time I ever played Toontown ever. It made me feel bad. This is a real story, by the way. If you sort my stream by average views per game, you can see that towards the bottom is Toontown. And I played for zero hours because that's how many viewers I lost during it. I had like 30 or 40 viewers before I booted it up and then it dropped down to like 10. I think it is the lowest watch time out of Super Mario Party. It is the lowest watch time of any game ever in the history of my uh, streaming career. Oh, here it is. Look how much it tanked. And then the moment I ended and played Cluster Truck, six more people, baby. Easy clap. Easy clap. So anyway, we're playing some Toontown today. It'd be funny if we all left while he was playing Toontown. No, no. no it wouldn't be funny. It wouldn't. It would be really hurtful and mean. I mean, it'd be kind of funny. But it'd also be really hurtful and mean if you all just left. I wouldn't I wouldn't love that if you guys did that. <laughs> and
Anyway, let's take a look at this video because I think it'll be very informative for us. It call it's called Why Toontown Online well, Died. Technically, I already started the video when you started watching, but I just wanted to clarify something here. In this video, I'm referring to the original Disney Toontown game, not the fan version that's still up and running today known as Toontown Rewritten. These are two totally separate things, and the latter is still going strong today. This video is just talking about the original Toontown made and published by Disney. In previous videos, I've always talked about how I've played a bunch of console games on my PS2 and Xbox 360, and how my introduction to PC gaming began with Minecraft. But you know that thing that you always forget about until you're looking right at it? Kind of like that fish you had back in second grade that died because you forgot to feed it, and then you look at it and it's like, oh wow, my fish died. You know the last time I played Toontown, this reminds me of it, is I was playing Toontown at my neighbor's house because my mom and dad were in the hospital, and then that's when I found out my dad died is when I was playing Toontown. And then I was like, I don't think I like Toontown anymore. And then I became an adult, and I had a lot of nostalgia for Toontown, and then the viewership thing happened. This game is like the worst thing that's ever happened to my life. I'm going to be playing this game today, and I'm going to find out that, like, <laughs> you know, some terrible shit just happened. This, ga this game is a curse. It's a blight on my life. Yeah, that's how I am with web MMOs. Games like Club Penguin, Neopets, and when I was really young, Webkins. Help I always thought Shoryu was really cute. Introduced me into multiplayer games. But the one that really did it for me was known as Disney's Toontown Online. Now this- Oh, by the way, can we get some hearts in chat? Uh, Gilbert Godfrey died, who is not someone we're very close to in this stream. Although we have, um, s like, spoken, quote-unquote, with Gilbert Godfrey before. Th there's this uh, infamous clip. It is Gilbert. Hi, this is Gilbert Gottfried, and hey, Jeffrey Epstein, I heard what you did, and that isn't very poggers. Absolute legend. This wasn't really a web MMO, but it was a similar concept for me, and I basically considered it one. I remember sitting at home watching the Disney Channel when I was about five or six, and seeing these constant advertisements posted by Disney, about a membership to the website. It looked really freaking cool and I decided to persuade my parents to get me a membership to the site. They agreed, bought me a membership, and I made an account on Toontown. Chat, did your parents let you get memberships for MMOs? My mom never got me a membership unless I specifically asked for it on Christmas and then she would get me one month. And I would only ever have membership for the month of December to January. And then I would have to wait 11 months doing free-to-play RuneScape. <laughs> or uh, or free-to-play Dofus or whatever I was playing at the time. They let me get a a, a, a Club Penguin. I, I It's probably easier to sell your parents on Club Penguin than it is on like RuneScape. Genuinely hope you have a lot of fun playing. It's an amazing game and a community. It's sad that it just has bad viewership due to the nature of the game, to be honest. Still love it to bits and the game isn't that amazing to watch. Okay, that was mostly negatives. And from this point on, I was immersed into the best online world I had ever experienced at the time. Toontown was unlike anything else around that time. The world was the best of all of them, the games were always fun, the people were friendly, and the whole premise of the game was amazing. Leveling up to buy more gags to attack the enemies was a great experience, and playing games in order to afford these gags made it all the more better. This game was truly my childhood, and like I've said, it was a ton of fun for young Robocast. But many people who were kids in the early 2010s were not able to experience the actual Toontown Online, the one that I was familiar with as a kid. In 2013, Toontown closed down for good with hardly any notice. There was no nostalgic closing event, there was no goodbye, just a closure of servers and everything that happened over the last 10 years was suddenly gone. So what exactly caused Disney to close this amazing game with millions of online players? Dude, someday that will happen with YouTube, and then all of the videos I have uploaded ever will disappear. We're going to be covering that in today's video, Why Toontown Died. Again, this isn't talking about Toontown Rewritten that is still around today, but the original Disney-owned and operated Toontown Online. No shot? What do you mean, no shot? YouTube will certainly get replaced. No website is going to have, like, like think of how big Facebook was, like, a decade ago. It was, like, unstoppable. Not a, 
yeah, I guess a decade ago. It was like unstoppable. And now, I mean, come on. <laughs> now, now they're just literally sitting in a boardroom just shopping names with each other. What if we just drop the face and we just call it book? People like books. You know? And then they're just, they're just working on anything. It's not growing. Facebook is definitely not growing. Okay, well, I'll tell you what. Daily motion's not going to be the thing that beats out YouTube. I'll tell you that. TikTok could. Toontown Online began with a public launch on June 2nd, 2003. After some beta testing, the developers, Disney Interactive and Shell Games, published the game. It was marketed as the first family-oriented 3D MMO. There was a free version that had a ton of restrictions, similar to the free version of Club Penguin, but the main focus was on the paid version. The subscription was $9.95 a month, and there were discounted rates if you got a quarterly or annual subscription. Now in this game, the player That's was a cartoon expensive. character in a world called Toontown. 10 this bucks a month? That's crazy. Especially for when it was when it was out. My God. Ten bucks back then, yeah. I, that's more expensive than like what Netflix started at, right? This world was under the threat of being taken over by corporate robots known as Cogs. And in order to save the unique and friendly cartoon world, the player had to battle these Cogs with humorous attacks that were called gigs. Oh, Robocast, that, that sounds like a stupid game. Why would you even play that? Well, don't worry, there's a lot more to it. There were of course mini games, shops, pets, customization, houses, quests, and a lot more. It was actually way more in depth with more to do than any other similar games that came out, once again like Club Penguin. This game actually had a premise, which was to defeat these evil cogs. It wasn't like the other games where you just hop on and hang out, and since it had a purpose, it held my attention for much longer than the strictly social games. As players began to play this newly released game, they realized the dependence upon playing with others. Because of this, many of the kids who played the game attracted their parents and older siblings into the game world, which caused the game to begin to appeal to a wide audience, just like Disney had planned. Dude, I played this game when I was too young to actually be intelligent enough to understand what I was doing, so I would just click the buttons and throw pies around and really not level up. Was there even PvP in this game? Like, does PvP exist? No, it's only PvE. I feel like how can a game, how can an MMO have that much staying value that there's still a community thriving around this game when there's no PvP? The player counts took off and the game was a decent success from the start, but nothing too crazy. It didn't really like blow up right away like some games, but it definitely would grow over time. The raids are the game nuts was awarded this. MMORPG of the Year by Computer Gaming World in 2003, and it also got a bunch of other awards as well. <laughs> World of Warcraft lost to Toontown? There's no way. Computer Gaming World oh, in 2003, tough. and it also got a bunch of that's other awards tough. as well. <laughs> but since the player base wasn't that's growing as much as it year. could have, Disney decided oh, to put out a out bunch of advertisements. Oh, I personally remember these advertisements coming on all the time, and they worked. Hey mom, can I throw some pies around? Oh no, I'm gonna go throw a piano in the street. Ugh, oh, really cringy 2000s mom face. Join Toontown! Yeah, bro, I remember these commercials like they were yesterday. They literally came on every 25 seconds, and it honestly, like I said, is what caused me to buy this game. Down. By the end of the year in 2003, <laughs> you know what Nick said on the podcast the other day? Nick said maybe the dumbest words that ever came out of his mouth. He said, dude, it just feels like the commercials just aren't like what they used to be when I was a kid. And I was like, yeah, because because you're a fucking adult not watching Nickelodeon. Like if you just watch Nickelodeon and Cartoon Network every day, you're going to see the same cartoons. You're just a 25 year old man who sits down to watch Lighthouse on Netflix. Like It's not. It's not the same if you just if you sat down on cable television to be the same thing. I agree with Nick. No, you're just not you're just not the target demo, so you're not seeing the ads. Toontown Online spiked to over one million registered players. Over the next few years, the game continued to grow as more and more users registered online to play. In 2005, Sony Online Entertainment realized that huge potential was being lost with the way the game is being distributed. 
and partnered with Disney in order to release the game in stores on a disc. Or as us 2000 kids like to call them, CD-ROMs. They released these discs and it worked out extremely well. Since the game was now easier for many other people to access, more players bought the game and began to play on the servers. And by the end of 2006, over 15 million accounts had been created on the game. The community was thriving and Toontown Dude, Online had a so lot big. going for it. In order to further the support of the game and expand, Disney put a lot of effort into keeping the community alive. In 2006, Disney launched their very first Toon Fest, which was a real-life event for Toontown fans to gather together and hang out. Now, I don't really know why anybody would go to this, but I mean, maybe if you're into that, it just doesn't look like my type of thing. But, obviously people did like it, because the event sold out and over 1,500 people attended in the first year. Dude, this actually just seems sick. It's like a LAN party with people dressing up as the characters. <laughs> that, that seems fire. I... I would go to that in a heartbeat. The event did super well and had a lot of positive reception, so a second one was held in 2007, and this one also did very well. There were also other major events that were in the game, like the one in 2007 where players had to recapture buildings that were taken by the COGS, and with each one that was captured, the money was donated to charity. I REMEMBER THAT! ...by the COGS, and with each one that was captured, the money was donated to charity. Oh, that was cool. But now it's time to branch out of this story. At the same time, around 2007, there was another online MMO that was becoming bigger than Toontown. This game, known as Club Penguin, was much different. It had flashier, better looking graphics, cool features, and a unique concept that was extremely appealing to kids. <laughs> this game was Crazy actually drawing a lot of players that away this from is better Toontown looking graphics. and began to pose a problem to the game. The people over at Disney noticed this and also saw all of the potential that Club Penguin had. Thus, in late 2007, Disney acquired Club Penguin for $350 million. At this point, Club Penguin had between 11 and 12 million registered users, and was generating over $40 million per year in revenue. $350 million with a chance to go to $700 million. Back then, too. That's insane. That's like a, that's basically, I mean, I don't know if they hit their things, but for inflation, that'd be like a billion dollar deer, a deal, if they hit the, if they hit the, uh, whatever things they had to hit. That's crazy. That seems crazy to me. A billion dollar gaming acquisition for just Club Penguin. With this new acquisition, Disney was now running four separate MMOs at the same time. There was Toontown, Pirates of the Caribbean Online, Pixie Hollow, and now Club Penguin. Some people began to worry that this was too much for them to manage, but the people at Disney stated, while it may be a lot to manage, we have really strong teams and we can do it. With this statement reassuring all of the players in these games, oh. confidence was restored and the communities continued. But as time progressed, Toontown began to decline. No more Toonfest happened, no more crazy events in the world happened, and more and more players began to leave for Club Penguin. While updates for Toontown slowed down, Disney did in fact continue to release them. But it was extremely obvious that most of their focus was on their new biggest moneymaker, Club Penguin. This trend continued until the company announced that in September of 2013, they would be closing down all of their other MMOs besides Club Penguin. This meant that Pixie Hollow, Pirates Online, and unfortunately, Toontown Online would all be closed for good. It's fucking Bob Iger's fault. It's Bob Iger's fault, that, that goddamn son of a bitch. As stated by Disney, we are shifting our development focus towards other online and mobile play experiences, such as Club Penguin and a growing selection of Disney mobile apps. Thus, Toontown Online officially closed on September 19th, 2013, with no word about what would happen to the game. As you can expect, many people were upset about this, and people were mad that the company would abandon <laughs> something that they spent so much time on. But with such a great community, there was still hope. So you may be wondering, YouTube, what bro. exactly was the reason that they closed this? Yeah, I saw it. Yeah, I didn't want to. I didn't want to view shame, but I had like sixty-four views. He's like, many people were sad. <laughs> I'm sure many people were sad, but that's just, it was a bad example. I mean, obviously, they talked about you know shifting resources to work on other games, which is understandable. But later on, we would find out the real reason why this happened. It turns out that Toontown wasn't making as much money as Disney hoped and other ventures such as Club Penguin would obviously provide them with more money. Club Penguin had over 100 million registered users, when Toontown was much less than that. 
they realized that if they began to work more on this new game, they could make more money with it, and that's kind of why they did that. So the fact that Toontown wasn't making enough money caused their development resources to shift over to Club Penguin, and caused these other three games to close. But like I said, there was still hope with such a great community. I feel like I'm weird because I never played Club Penguin except as a teenager for the memes to get banned because that was a big meme. But I, I did play Toontown unironically. On the same day that Disney announced the closure of Toontown Online, a group of volunteers began looking into a way to keep it running. Work started on Toontown Rewritten, which was basically a version of Toontown restored by fans. The game was announced, and people had hope that this version would keep the community and the game alive. And it honestly did. From the start, this game had a dedicated team working to keep the experience going, and it's still there till this day. The community is great, the support is going well, and most importantly, this version is free, which opened up opportunities to many more people that couldn't play the original game. I actually hopped on the game for the first time in 8 years, and that's how I'm recording the footage for this video. After this long of a break, the game feels the same, if not better, than when I played back as a kid. It's crazy to think that people can truly love a game enough to put their own time and money into keeping it running, and without the people who made this, Toontown as many know it would be completely dead. And it doesn't stop here. Rewritten is going above and beyond what Disney would have done with the game. I don't really follow this game, but as I was doing my research, it appears as if they're releasing something entirely new known as Toontown Corporate Clash, and it looks really freaking cool. Wait, it's I've an heard entirely good new about game this. made by the same volunteers that made Rewritten, and I'm sure that many of the active players are excited to see what will come with this game. If the developers are watching this, I give major props to you guys for doing what you're doing. You guys single-handedly saved the game that defined many people's Dude, childhood. Dude, who are these Wizard this 101 Andes that are flooding my chat right now? We're, we're not starting this, boys, all right? It's Toontown Tuesday, and then we're done with the MMOs unless Jerma beats my ass in another set of video games. I'm not, I'm not just giving you guys Wizard 101 Wednesdays for free, okay? This is already going to kill my stream enough as is. This video may sound like it's sponsored by Toontown Rewritten, and honestly, I kind of wish it was. That would be pretty cool, but it's not. I just thought this would be a cool and nostalgic video for me to make, and I realized that it may be much different from what I usually do, but this is kind of one that I really wanted to do myself, because I was really into this game as a kid. Did any of you guys play this game? Were you sad when it closed? If you have answers to anything, please let me know in the comments below. Anyways guys, thank you so much for watching, I will see you guys next time, and peace. Alright, well that was interesting. Okay, I have a curious bone that I want to itch. Can you speedrun Toontown? <laughs> How does this come up? How does this come up when I look up Toontown speedrun? So I played Toontown in 2022. Wait. What do you... <laughs> What's going on here? There's something about this that seems wrong to me. This is a year ago to the day. Pick a tune to play is upside down. That's so wacky. Today we're playing through some Toontown. So I haven't played Toontown in like 10 years. And I guess that's what we're doing now. This is a, this is a blast of nostalgia right now. <laughs> the music and all that stuff. Do I get to pick what he looks like or is that Dude, just... Dude, is this going to be what my stream's like right now? This is literally going to be what I'm about to do. I haven't played Toontown in years. Let's check it out. This is crazy. <laughs> Chad, what if we just don't do it and I play GeoGuessr for fucking six hours straight? Huh? Huh? What do you think, guys? What do you think? What is this? There's a speed run for Toontown where you solo the vice president. This is the end game. 
Dude, it's crazy. I, I was never a competent enough child. I was just a big, dumb idiot to have fought in any of the final bosses. But it says the record for beating the CEO is in our... In 20 minutes? It seems like blessings How? keep falling in my lap. How is this a thing? Why am I listening to Chance the Rapper and watching a Toontown speedrun? Toontown turned me into a savage. They keep your eyes open, you won't like what you see. They be here for a minute, now they're uh -huh. gone in a week. You trying to down to the peak, I'm trying to Andre the beat. Lord, can you tell me where my faith is? is Cody Allen? and I still ain't made the A-list. Ain't a problem if you tell me how you feel, girl. Turnt you know the road out. Rules, but you need the real Dude, I would like to try a speedrun of a boss today. Is there a good boss to fight? The Cog Building. Bunther beat it in 11 seconds. You know what? That is art. That is art, I'll tell you that much. Okay, well, beating, beating Bunther seems pretty easy. Or b beating those guys, I should say, in the Cog Building. Uh, should we boot it up, boys? Should we play some Toontown? Hold up. Someone sent me a code for a Toontown account. But I have to look through all the people asking me. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, there are some genuine pros at Toontown in the DMs right now. All right, let's boot it up. Let's fucking boot this up, man. Wizard 101 Wednesdays. I will only do Wizard 101 Ooh. Wednesdays if Toontown Tuesdays pops off. What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? All right, Lauren, I'm taking your account right now. We've updated the terms of service. You must reread the terms of service. How? What you, how? <laughs> God damn it. God damn it. This fan-made game is making me read terms of service. Am I smoking? It says open Toontown rewritten. Oh, you have to log in on the browser? Oh. Oh, wait. Does that mean the account that I'm on has to do that? 
Or do I have to do that? Well, let's find out. Play now. Play now. Play now. I'm not going to hit the gritty. I'm not just going to hit the gritty right now. I'm I'm busy and I'm stressed. They have tune guard codes. Okay, I have a new account. I have a new account. I have a new account. From Stuffles. That password doesn't even work, Stuffles. Oh, there's a capital. Classic. Classic blunder. Fusion Fall Fridays. Pirates of the Caribbean. I don't even have a I don't even have an alliteration. Don't say don't no 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 don't do point to graph chart going down viewers falling. I do need a tune guard token stuffles. Webkins Wednesday Wednesdays swashbuckling Sundays. <laughs> yeah. Dofus Fridays. Everybody loves Toontown. I got it. I got it. We're in. Thank you very much, Stuffles. Hearts and chat for Stuffles, everyone. They're launching me into the Tooniverse. What tune should I play? I think I want the dog because they probably have the highest squirt stat. <laughs> make your own? If I make my own, I won't have... <laughs> no, 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 I don't want to be your friend, Jay Bumbletoon. Froggo, please. Okay, all right. Froggo, I said, Froggo, no means no. Can you respect that, please? <laughs> How do I even walk around? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, let me get out. Get me out of here! <laughs> get me out of here! Alright, I think we'll be safe in here for now. And then we can recuperate. 
Hello, Banker Bob. Need any help? <laughs> Toontown community. Man, I really hope you enjoy the game. Also, the Toontown community won't even let me play it. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Let me. I need to gather my bearings to figure out what's going on. Let me play some trolley games, okay? Oh no, I missed the bus. Wait, wait. why did you guys all sit? How do I sit? Wait, <laughs> wait. I the whole point was that I was going to go. <laughs> yeah, that, that was my train. Okay, I'll take this one. I'll take this one. What do you mean it's full? Hey, I have dibs on next train. I can't even get in anymore. I can't. You know what? I'm actually leaving. I'm actually leaving. Let's go to the punch, uh, punchline place. That seems fun. Okay, how do I figure out the new catalog? Teleport. Oh, I have a house. Oh, yeah! Oh, bitches. Nothing like home, sweet home. All right. Here I am at home. This is great. Nobody can enter. I have a lot of jelly beans. That's exciting. All right, what does this button do? Move furniture. Wait, you can do this? I don't want to mess up their home too much. It's pretty well decorated. You know, if you were to change a couple of things, I probably would maybe move this chest and, like, it seems a little bland in the corner. So, you know, I might just, I might just place it over here, and then I might push this couch to the wall, you know, just as a thought experiment. And then maybe just open up this space a little bit by just rotating this chair, you know, and just putting that down here. And then you could also just rotate this chair. And then you just, you're really opening up the space now is what you're doing. You know, now you can look around and, and, and you're a little more, oh, it's more inviting, you know? Uh, wait, okay, why, why do you keep saying wrong character? Friends. How do I see, like, my stat bar? Escape. You have 15 laugh? That's not good. Wait, I need to switch characters then.
Okay, apparently the character I'm supposed to play is this cat. Little droopy jiggle nugget. <laughs> the dude loves saying that. Oh, baby! Why am I short? Why am I so short? Am I in an epic area? I wish I could jump around. Oh my god. No Andromada. I refuse. We're at late game area? Hello! Hello, shopkeep. I would like your finest wares. What do you need? I would like your finest wares, shopkeep. Wow, <laughs> you can't all need gags. I don't believe that you all need gags, okay? I, I am here because I need gags. Choose a tune task. Come later if you need a tune task. I want a tune task. New silly teams. Go to HQ? Okay. Wait. Wait, I'm stuck. My character's too small to fight through the crowd. So how how would I get how would I how would I do something, you know? Well, who the hell are you? Would you like to plan a party? Sure. Yeah, let's do it. Get me out of here. Let's turn on a party. Hosting a party is a lot of fun. Start with the bottom arrows. Countdown. Okay. Jukebox. Double the tunes. Cannon. This whirl gig wonder speeds up as tunes hop on. Trampoline. Oh, tug of war would be fun for a party. Fireworks. Oh, gifts for every tune would be nice. Oh, streamers! This is a waste of money? It's not that much. It's like 10 coins. Right? Choose your guests. We'll make it open to the public. We'll invite all of our friends, of course, too. Uh, today is the 12th, so we'll make it as soon as possible. Cannon or lame? Well, now I feel like I have to get the cannon. show up to my party. Oh, 
Oh, my party starts in two minutes. Okay. <laughs> I'm excited, boys. Party time. Oh my god, I didn't know you could play in this POV. I'm trying to seriously fish. You can't just stand in front of me and say, I'm a fish. Okay, you guys aren't respecting the sanctity of fishing. When does my goddamn party start? Click the book, the book in the bottom. I'm late to my own party. I'm so embarrassed. Go to the hosting tab in the bottom. Why am I getting so much money? What's happening? Why am I getting money? Let's start the party, everybody! Woohoo! Party time! Damn, I really outdid myself. I hope people show up to my party. Oh, yeah! Dude, I swear to God, if I lost all of my party progress, I'm going to be so upset.
party time! I should have maybe gotten a few more activities. So what does this do? Oh no, it's the fireworks show! Gather round, everybody! I can't see shit. Oh. I haven't seen one firework. Oh, there's beans dropping! Hey, Jump, I know this is all does, guys. I still can't see... I still can't see any fireworks. I'm not gonna lie, we spent the... Oh, there they are! Nice! Yeah! Yeah, looking good. Well, that was that was a blast. Get me the fuck out of here. Uh, hey, this is really fun, guys. Keep the party going. No, I'm on my way. Yeah, I'm going to the dance floor. Just give me a just give me a moment. All right, I think I should do a challenge of some sorts. Huh? Does anyone agree with me? I feel like I should be trying to defeat some bosses. Do Cellbot HQ? Where is Cellbot HQ? Bottom left. Map. Yeah! Let's do this! We're gonna beat their ass! Wait, what? Did I just become a big suit? Did I become evil? Lewis would like for you to join their boarding group. Sir Zeppenzar. Sure, yes. What's up, sir? It's just me and Sir Zeppenzar. Only your group leader can do Okay, well, now I don't. <laughs> now I wish I hadn't joined your group, Sir Zeppenzar. Right? Can I? I would like to leave this boarding group. I just realized why you guys were spamming this on. Alright, me, Sir Zeppenzar, and the crew are about to go nuts. Sir Zeppenzar, are we going this year or what?
This is how Quackity got his start. Like, the Quackity. Sir Zippenzainer! Are we are we going in? All you do is lie to me, Sir Zippenzainer. Is this all people just waiting to get in? I think I have to wait until these guys get in the elevator first. Oh, I'm in! I'm in! Wait. I don't... <laughs> I don't think this is supposed to be happening. I think I, I might have glitched through the game. Oh no. Okay, I think we clipped through. Okay, some cringe lord, no offense, keeps leaving the elevator and then rejoining the elevator so that the elevator never goes so new seats never form. We're trying to play the video game here. This is why nobody likes Toontown anymore! This would never happen in Wizard 101. It's a much more wholesome. Alright, 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 alright. I think what I must do is change the servers. Can I even change the servers when I'm already in? anyone's boarding group again. I've lost all trust from all Toontown players. You are all dead to me. Is Zapwood good? matter let's go don't say which one chat you know I'm smarter than that I simply lied now all the idiots in zap town look so dumb and me and my boys are about to roll the F up let's get it done crew it's always been me and Randolph and Hourglass. Okay, the, the guy on the left, I'm not so sure about. Kind of the weird one of the group. But Blubbery Nugget, big fan. Oh, Big Droopy gets in. Wait, if you're Big Droopy and I'm Little Droopy, who's driving the boat? Oh shit, a six man? Is six man hard?
You are hereby promoted to full-fledged Cellbots. Congratulations. Senior Vice President Cellbot. Go and make that sale. Oh, we're pretending to be new cogs. And then we're going to run up Dunup on the Cellbot VP. Shut the fuck up. What, what a narc! Why would you narc on us? All right, six blubber nuggets. Okay, all right, all right. Uh, 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 hmm. Okay, hmm. I, I'm kind of a squirter myself. Uh, let's go. Hmm, let's go fire hose. Right. Oh, that's a good cake. Big damage! I got my fire hose. Brrr, scrub. Oh no, they're razzle dazzling. Not me! Okay, we're fine. What? 20 damage? Okay, all right. I think, I think let's play as a team here. I'm going to drop a fucking anvil on them. We got to get this level 12 out of here. C cool. Good job. Oh, I healed. Oh, good job. Oh, thank you. <laughs> good job healing. <laughs> Use sound? Like, what do you, I am. Hello? This is sound. Like, to communicate with my teammates? Hello? See, they can hear me. No, I've been constricted! Buzzword. <laughs> Dude, I love the idea of an enemy being like a business suit type and their damage is saying buzzwords. Like all they do is they go synergize. And you're like, oh, oh, no. Per my last email. Oh, oh. Uh, we'll go elephant trunk. The triple elephant trunk. It's never been done! Dude, this guy really just popping people out the pussy, huh? They grow up so fast. Amen. I mean, hey, call me crazy, but I think triple elephant trunk. Okay, we're not doing triple elephant trunk this time. Whoa! Make sure you use the gags in the far right. They're the best. Well, shouldn't I not use it? Because I only have one? I only have one opera singer. I don't want to use it. I'm so That's why I'm using my elephant trunks. I, I shouldn't use him now. This guy's the easiest guy, right? I probably shouldn't have even used sound against one person. That was stupid. Oh, he's still up. Power trip. Did you have a nice trip? See you next fall. No, it's Mr. Hollywood. All right. Uh, what, what, what is something that I have a lot of? I will, I will literally cream pie the shit out of this guy. This guy's a juggling god. Wait, wh how are you getting involved now? 
Thanks, Rudolph. Why are we laughing? Yeah, I delivered the finishing blow! And, hey, when in Rome... Like my fit? No. I love it. How do we get out of here, guys? Are we supposed to chase after them? Oh, shit! Second phase? Are we playing goddamn Dark Souls? trying to get away. No! single enemy. If it's just one enemy, keep it simple, stupid. Don't use a sound effect. Squirt on them. Hopefully, oh, you know what? How do you feel about a piano, motherfucker? Okay, I guess we should have been on the same page. Check DMs. I did, don't have any. Use fire hose. I guess it makes sense to use... Water against... Robots. Everyone keeps saying I show speed DM me. I think that's just a fake person in chat, Chad. Not the one that got hit by that attack. Yeah, it was pretty obviously fake. But I double checked to make sure it is fake. Alright, the guy on the right is almost injured. The guy on the left is, is fully alive. Here's what I think I do. I use a bamboo cane that hits everybody. The 45 damage will hit the person on the right. Oh, that heals. killed three of them. Sorry, I'm doing a little support here. Plus, this guy has a comical rainstorm thing. Randolph said, just do whatever will adapt. Yeah, we're the best. <laughs> Holy shit, they brought in the big guys here. Alright, 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 alright. Let me hit him with a good old-fashioned ow. Yeah! 
stop looking at chat. There's no new messages. Okay, you know what? There are no new messages because every time I look over at chat, you're spamming that same exact message. <laughs> so, so by proxy, then you're right. Damn, they're lighting up big goofy. All right, all right, all right. Simple, you know what? Let me do a simple heal. I got the heal down. Don't worry. That's all me. That's all me. Yeah. No problem. Just don't lose health again. <laughs> okay, I'm not gonna lie. Randolph, you kind of choked the bag there by letting the level 12 move. I'm just gonna say it. I thought you would have taken care of business, but you went with the Awugo horn. Probably should have gone a little higher grade. My bad. <laughs> all right, all right. Well, now I gotta heal fucking Randolph. Ludwig, fuck. Oh, I've joined in. <laughs> I joined in just to do the dance. When the boss jumps, you need to jump in this round. So be ready. Okay. All right, I have to be ready. Delete key. People are so worried about me. I'm kind of thriving here, boys. Get him! Insert key? I don't have that either. This might be harder than Verdun. People are saying that this boss is about as hard as Melania in Elden Ring. Oh, yeah, keep pushing them back, baby! You'll know you hit a good color when you see the splat. Oh, the splat in color. Hey, don't worry about me, I'm splatting left and right. Hit a two with the pie, it gives them a lap point. There you go, King. Eat up. Oh no, he's a Wu Gang! This is the 
first stream I'm actually watching uh, a Ludwig video on my other monitor. <laughs> you know what? At least when I looked over at chat, there was me like, JUMP! No! I thought I timed it perfectly. Damn, how much fucking pie does this guy need? I'm getting lit up, boys. I'm getting lit up on the front line here. Whoa! I'm gaming? Oh, I thought I dodged all those. Some great content. Damn it! Account has two unites if you need. But right now he doesn't need to use one. Okay, you guys are distracting me and I'm getting lit up. New strat, new strat everybody. Alright, keep it going over there, you guys got it. Yeah. All you guys. Thank you for the help. Yeah, keep it up! Coward? Okay, first of all, I'm hitting my pies from downtown. I'm just a long range. Okay, that pie missed. This pie hits though, watch. See that? Look at that. See these pies? They're hitting. Look at that, that was a direct hit. Definition being carried. Okay. If people are gonna come at my Toontown reputation, that's where I draw the line. I'm getting lit up. I, how do you straight? It's not a health thing, you have to push him off. Oh, splat him then! Doesn't it not make sense to have somebody behind the guy then? Am I crazy? This boss takes eternity? Is this like a high level boss in the Toontown universe? Knock, to knock him out, you need stunners. This is the easiest boss. But it's still a boss, huh? Wait, are there more bosses after this boss? There's four? How long does each boss take? takes this long? Somebody who's watching just start just start getting all the One Piece episodes out of the way. My God, you lodge got to turn down the game slightly. That was kind of a cheap shot, I won't lie. I got lit up when I was AFK. Oh, this is it, this is it. This is it, push him! Oh, how did he not fall? Okay, I'm, I'm sick and tired of getting hit by these goddamn fields, these discs. I'm a gamer. 
Okay, what happened to this guy? I got you. I'll help you out. Shit. No! Okay, that was way less effective than I thought it'd be. Sorry, I'm not helping you out again. <laughs> Oh, there it is. This is it. This is it. He's still not pushed off. Oh. Let's go. Oh, cool. Wow. You know what? The song gets old. I'm gonna say it. No, it doesn't? Okay. This song is so good, I don't know what you're talking about. Big Droopy, we've been listening to it for 20 minutes uninterrupted. I'm not saying it's bad. I'm just saying it slaps hard. <laughs> you have brain rot. <laughs> Yippee! It's great to be free. Thanks for all your help. I'm in debt. Here's my card if you ever need a hand. Who just ditched us? Wait, why is everyone ditching? Oh, I just ditched too. Alright, well that was fun. Field office next? I don't know about all that, fellas. We did our hour of Toontown here, didn't we? I doubt you can keep up with me. Bro, you're a level four. Let me just hit you straight up with the the goddamn wedding cake. No, I can I'm gonna drop a boat on you. Guys. You lured. Wait, why is everyone making fun of me? What do you mean? That was my only boat! throw the wedding cake. At least I get to see the wedding cake get thrown. Wait, who the hell is Professor Pete? Wait, he just restocked my gags. What the hell? Who's this Pete guy? How much do I get for this? I didn't... I didn't get any. If you can't take the heat, stay out of the kitchen. Bro, we're playing Toontown, okay? Don't... Don't, don't hit me with that. Do the building? Alright. 
Is this a building? I'll try out a building. Meow, how are you, meow? Wait, why doesn't it let me say guys? Why can't I say yes? What's what? Oh, it doesn't let you say swears. Yeah, it won't let me say penis. You're gonna get them banned? Okay, I'm sorry, I'll stop. Just wanted to drop one penis. Wait, why are you tickling me? Teehee? Thanks for the tickles. I've lured them in with a $10 bill. What does luring in do? Song and dance. Oh, shit. Is he doing the gritty? Whoa, that was fucking dope. I kind of don't want to kill him now. Are you shooting him out of a cannon? Holy shit. That seems like an OP move to shoot someone out of a cannon. They're using really OP endgame stuff on like a random level 8 boss. On like a uh, on like one of the easiest NPCs, we're just killing NPCs with massive destruction. I hope you brought a stretcher with you. No, I don't think we have that, but we do have a cannon. It's almost depressing how in this universe they're all just you know work in suits. What server? We're on Zaptown. I love how you picked an avatar representative of your actual height. Okay. All right. Very cool. Very funny. Hi, Stuck the Duck. Glad to help. Hey, yo, what's good? Thanks, fam. <laughs> I, I, what the fuck did Clerk Will do in that spot? Use lure after someone else places a trap. Well, I didn't have I didn't have my lure ready. I didn't know. I would have used my lure. I'll lure this time. Consider me a lure Larry. I'm luring this guy in. It's so funny knowing everyone who plays this game is a full ass adult. Twenty three. Mr. Freeze sets up some pixie dust and then pee pee poofs. Thanks, Mr. Freeze.
Damn, he's getting that suck, suck 3,000. You didn't set up the trap! Why don't I have a single trap? Why am I trapless? Oh my god, we just annihilated. You can't have all of the gags. Oh, I see. Stuck the Duck is a famous person in Toontown. I mean, he's no Commander J, but surely he gets the job done. What was the announcement? That Saturday, I'm going to go to Genesis, and we're going to do a stream at Genesis, where we do a mash-off. Uh, and if you're at Genesis, uh, well, I'll, do, I'll be there for a stream live in the place. I'm going to chase you out of town. Okay, all right. Are we, are we trapping? What's the dealio here? I'm going to go with the classy elephant trunk. You guys figure out the rest, okay? If all the Ludbuds start and sign a petition for Disney to bring this game back, we might see it be revived. I think that would be the biggest waste of time and effort ever. Oh, we better have lured. I'm going to be so upset if no one lured. I say it's the biggest waste of time because this game is already that. Oh, shit! Hey, good combo. The rewritten team already uh, did it. You know what I mean? Like, the, the game looks and it seems like it works very well. And I think they have, like, events that happen. I, I, I'm trying to say that Disney would ruin this. Yeah, they even made Corporate Clash, right? I'm the boss. Cool. The next floor is going to be insane. Oh, this floor is about to blow my, my, my mind a little bit. This is the top floor, right? All right. Hey, I'm sorry. Sometimes you just have to use the maximum fact maximum. Who's got a trap ready? I'm dropping a presentation. Hope someone used a trap. Okay, we have a trap. We got a good trap. Oh, this is looking good. Double presentation. Show the data. game's kind of boring. <laughs> Alright, well, hey, at least I didn't go down to 15 viewers. Alright, I'm going to use my piano. And it's going to destroy them. This is so devious. That's cartoonish. Two pianos? Oh, 
Oh, I mean, we crushed that. Absolutely lambasted them. Good job, Princess Violet. I mean, really well done there. How did I do? How did I do? Give me some beautiful throw points. Some drop points. We love that. I'm ready for a promotion on my law bot and my boss bot. All right, I, you know what, guys? Hey, you know, I feel like, hey. <sighs> guys, I literally can't even move. We fixed the building! Yeah, baby! Dude, Jesus Christ. The building will have your photo? Wait, forever until eternity? Twenty more minutes? Guys! Toontown's been fun. Hey, I, you know what? I'll even say it's been real and it's been fun. It's even been real fun. But I think it's about that time where we wrap up Toontown. We wrap up Toontown. We're not wrapping up the stream. But we got to wrap up Toontown. And we have to play in a game that's that's actually for, for children more. We got to stop playing these adult games. It's time to get gold. We just got to get gold. That's it. That's it. That's it. If you don't know, this is GeoGuessr Duels. Don't say not again. Don't say not again. How do they already guess? How do they already guess? Chat, how do they already guess? I don't even know where the hell I am. Chat, I don't know where I am. Oh my god. Oh my god. Holy shit, They're, that was a terrible guess from them. It was Ukraine. Toontown's done. Very st actually rolled my eyes when you booted this up. I just want to get gold. I'm a simple man with simple desires. All I want to do is be a gold gamer. I won't play this for that long. You're losing viewers? I don't care if I have five viewers as long as I'm gold ranked. I'm just, I can, I can drop down to 2k viewers, 200 viewers. If I'm gold rank, I'm happy. Russia, Russia. You know what? I'm going to take a wild guess. No one has thought of this. Bang, Russia. Easy guess, easy guess, big points. I'm getting gold today. If you don't know, it's a very simple game where you have to figure out where you are in the world based off of the, the sites you see around you. So you use pertinent information, like this car has a European license plate. It's also a French car. And then on the side, it says dot .ee, -E, I think. E-E. Does that say dot dot .ee? -E? What is E-E? -E? Estonia? Oh, yeah. It's Estonia. And then, you know, with that information, if you're closer, you get points. The other person loses points. And if they lose all their points, they're out. Easy. So, uh, I, right, you get ranked. And right now, I am a, a beautiful silver rank. But I deserve gold. Hold up. Yellow license plate driving on the right side of the road. It has to be. I think we're in Jordan. I enjoyed my stay. No, it's fun. What do you mean? Everybody loves GeoGuessr. No, oh, it's great fun. Everybody loves this game. Yeah. Easy guess. Okay, now you're just stream typing me. <laughs> Vroom, what the heck? How did you have such a bad guess that was equally as bad as mine? 
play Toontown? <laughs> Dude, I've already played a little bit of Toontown today. Everybody loves GeoGuessr. Oh my god, what a terrible guess. It's a healing round, so it didn't matter because I was already max health. Okay, 1.5x damage. Punto. Punto Madre. Isn't that the Dominican Republic's flag? Wait. CL's Colombia, no? No, it can't be Colombia because there's no yellow license plates. Could be Chile. Where'd the flag go? I'm assuming it's Chile. Because Colombia has yellow license plates on the cars. It was Chile. Chile. Almost! Santiago. Means whale's vagina. Chat's frozen under you. Um, all right, Europe, French car. Beautiful, beautiful, bright buildings. Seems Greek almost, no? No! Oh God. Oh, Italy. Maybe? Stinking Portugal? Oh my god, we almost just lost. Seems like Brazil. No, I'm not sure if it's Brazil. Oh. Has to be Senegal. Four more games and we're in this bitch. How'd you know? Because I am Mr. Worldwide. I, it's like you guys don't understand. I, I understand that, like, I come on here, we do some streams and some jokes and some ha-has and some hee-hees, but I'm a well-traveled adult. Four more games when we win. We're already... So this is Poland. I can tell you that right now. I, I'm, I don't even have to look on a map to... Like, I, I don't even need to look around. I know we're in Poland. How? Because of this post sign, it's only on the one... Okay, clearly you're cheating because there's no fucking universe that was pulled. It was Estonia. You're just copying me now. Now we know we're getting sniped. So that's what... See? See? That's genius. Now I know I'm getting stream sniped, so I'm going to play things a little differently, okay? Ah, a bit creative. A bit creative. I, I, I pretended to be dumb. I merely pretended to be dumb, and now I have found out that I am being copycatted. Oh, now they're guessing first to, to, to feign that. No, I'm not a stream sniper. No. No, not me. No. That's not me. That would. No, I guess first. Sri Lanka. That was a tough one. All right, big open dry area. Uh, interesting, interesting. I mean, hey, everybody knows where we are. It is beautiful, sunny Australia. I lied! 
deception. You can tell where we are because this helmet. It was obviously a Kenyan helmet. Easy. Easy, baby. Easy, let's go. What did I say? It's gold day, baby. It's gold day. Get your ass in gear, all right? Salute the goddamn stream. We're getting gold today, baby. Come on. Get involved. Why not us? Why not today, huh? We deserve it. We've earned this. Just so obvious. Just so obvious. That's a European DSL truck. Just fucking kidding. <laughs> I'm less, uh, less obvious, less obvious. Could only be the fine language of CB Irish. That's, that's not, fi that's not Finnish, that's Swedish. I know Swedish when I see it. A la carte and otai. Okay, it was Finnish. Now I know they're cheating. Now I know they're cheating. See? Typical. Typical. <laughs> Now I know I'm getting stream sniped. All right. I'm on to them. I'm on to them. Yep, 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 yep. That's how you find out. That's how you find out. Now I have to play a little deceptively. I have to play a little deceptively because they're stream sniping. So sad, you know? It's just sad, I guess, to see. If I had to guess, we're in Denmark because of yellow license plates. Cow. I lied! I lied! We're obviously in the UK because we're driving on the left side of the road. Okay, driving on the right here. Let's take a peek. Obviously in Europe. I mean, that's just German. Through and through. That's just the German language through and through, if I had to guess. Dean Twegg. Fjör. Okay. That's tough. It was German. I didn't think they'd actually listen to me. I thought I would have done reverse psychology. All right, we have a lot of information right now, a lot of information, but I need to see one car. Dude, this is like the site of where they filmed Tokyo Drift. Look at this mountain. Are two cars supposed to fit down this road? There's no way. Europeans really built different. Give me one car. How high does this mountain go? Oh, there we go. There we go. That isn't the best case scenario. I'll keep it a stack. Oh, just kidding. There's way more cars. This doesn't help me much. Oh, that makes sense. Because it looked like Italy, but the license plates weren't European. So it's the small nation within a nation of San Marino. Similar to the Vatican, it exists within the confines of Italy, but it's a, its own independent country. That's Japanese.
That's Japanese for sure. Is this not Japanese? That looks like hiragana to me. Singapore? Oh no, it was Malay. Okay, that makes sense. That was hiragana? Oh, well, well, well. Look who the cat dragged in today. I mean, there's only one place this could be. Only one place on this beautiful green earth of ours. If it looks American, but it, it, they're driving on the left, then it's on Australia. But if it looks really beautiful and you think it's Australia, then it's New Zealand. Okay? Holy shit, I've never been to Melbourne. I apologize. I apologize, Melbourne, Melbourneers. I, I apologize, first and foremost. What? No! Dude, uh, I guess fast because I thought he was AFK. Oh, uh, why do I lose 22 MMR? I'm. I'm You're trolling? I, I am literally getting stream sniped. In my favorite video game. Germany. <laughs> okay, I'm getting better at discerning Bangladesh from Thai from... Malay. Good guess, not gonna lie, good guess. Theirs was slightly better, it's okay. Where's Toontown? We already beat the game. They said I was one of the best to have ever done it. The John Hill Estate. Can I see one car, please? I think I know where we are, but I want to see a car before I pull the trigger. I just, I wanted to make sure we were driving on the left side of the road. Okay, are you really just waiting until I guess and then just guessing in the same place I am, Darton? Because it's, if that's the, you know what? Here's what I'm going to do. Here's, here's how I'm going to beat snipers. I am not going to guess unless they guess. Here's the thing. I'm paid to be here. I can take all the time in the world. Still sticking to my strategy of always guessing second. Meal deals. Tesco's? Probably in the UK then if I had to guess. I need, I need 
need to find more cars. I need to look at license plates. I'm not getting much. Okay, so cookout is only available in certain states, primarily East Coast based. And in South based. There's also a checkers. Ooh, good guess. It was, it was Tennessee. And we almost got full points there. Good guess, good guess. I think I went like Kentucky or something. So right under. Uh, all right, what are we doing here? UD Samuel Presidente. Look at this dog pack. Holy shit, on their way to... See some friends. Exactly like La Paz. Well, the moment I saw La Paz is it, it, it's one of the most like jaw dropping cities. It's like no city you've ever seen in your life. It's amazing. Here, this is a picture of it. Can't even pronounce it. Okay, puta madre, pondejo. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Come correct. Come correct. <laughs> Better not hear about <laughs> no more. No more gringos in my chat, mister. No, thank you. I'll have you know I am. 55% Spanish, okay? <laughs> so, yeah, that's right, Ablamoth. That's correct. They call me the Ebuy of YouTube live streaming. Okay, uh, obviously Europe. We're in a pretty major city here. That is the Slovakian... No, it's the Serbian flag. Wait, is that the Czech flag? No, I was right. Amazing guess. It was the Slovakian flag. We were within 1.4. Alright, this is Japan for sure. It's not Japan at all. I lied in hopes that it would bait whoever's playing against me. I've never seen this language in my life, though. I swear to God. Oh, my God. I should have stayed where I was. I should have stayed where I was. I was in Malaysia, and I switched to Vietnam and Cambodia because I got nervous. I thought I was too far south.
Hey, right there in the outback, in it. Right there in the outback, in it. I think this GeoGuessr content is mostly just me offending cultures. <laughs> what I'm noticing pretty quick. All right, a lot of homes, a lot of hills. A lot of homes, a lot of hills. You know what? Just absolutely cranking it in the dark right now. But this seems like Iceland. Okay, it's definitely Norway, I lied. Very North. Okay, all right, little healing round. Easy guess, easy guess, it was Ghana. I didn't need to be directly on because I could only heal so much. All right, we're max HP. Max HP sitting here in the beautiful Greek country. Love the content, but I wanted to vouch for Tim.TV for Fortnite Tourney. He did not send me here. I'm just a loyal simp. Anyway, have a good stream. Tim the Dub. <laughs> I like ending off with his name just for like a little recognition. Uh, I don't think we're very ocean based, so let's go a little higher increase. Okay, should have gotten lower actually, but still a better guess. 566 off, not bad, not bad. Double points here. We have a doctor on the right, let's take a look. No, it's not a doctor, it's a word. Okay, seems Eastern European based on architecture in overall everything else. I can't see what that sign says. Thought. I can't see what it says. It looks like an L to me, though. And maybe a T. So maybe it's Lithuania or Latvia. I'm going to go in the middle of both of them. I didn't click! What do you mean I didn't click? All I wanted to do today was get gold. It's all I wanted to do. I just, it was a simple goal of mine. Get gold. It's just not happening. It's just not happening. It's just not, I just don't understand it. I just don't understand it. If I go up against Kara Miller one more time, they, they got, I did click. I know I clicked. I know I clicked. The game lambasted me. Where the hell am I? What is this? This is like where you wake up in a in a movie and you do nothing. Okay, it was Jordan. I was correct about that. I guess more accurately Israel. All right, this is an easy win against Kara. Kara, make this easy for me, huh? Don't make me sweat, Kara. Don't make me sweat. A lot of bricks. A lot of cars. Give me one sign. Give me one sign. I'm a simple man, God. I request a single sign. I will extrap- Oh, God. Oh, God. 
I don't know if it's Asia or South America yet. I'm leaning towards South America. Definitely South America. It was Brazil. Unfortunate that we were so far. We could have gotten the dub there if I went a little lower to Bolivia. All right. Mr. Boysenberry. Pick your own or buy. No prickles. Parking. You know, that was a little deceiving because it's the same color. You might think no parking. They should have considered that. I mean, nobody loves boysenberries more than the, the people down south. The sign is confusing here, though. Anyone else? Papamoa Beach. Okay, so it's a beach place. I'm going to assume that leads me towards New Zealand more than... Um, I'm going to go south New Zealand. I almost never go here. And for good fucking reason. It's always north. Oh, there's literally a place called Papamoa. Big log farm, windmill, European cars, say less. Sweden, but that's a, that's a W, that's a W. I went Denmark. That's a good win! I, I don't even want to listen to the celebration music. D did he say he was going to play Wizard 101? No, Golden, I did not. For your troubles, I would I would have let you win, just saying, Ben. Ben, I don't want to be let win. I just want to win, and if I lose, it's because I'm getting sniped. All right, we're in Europe. In Germany. 100%. I'm going to guess Hamburg. No reason why I'm guessing Hamburg, but I'm guessing Hamburg. I don't I've never been to Hamburg. Turns out it was actually Vienna, Austria. Fun fact. Interesting that they also guessed. Interesting, interesting. Just that's just interesting to me that they also guessed. It's just interesting to me. I don't even have to think about this. We're obviously in Norway. Wizard 101 is my childhood. I've never played it in just thinking of how Toontown went. I don't think it'll go great, guys. All right. Th there's a clear answer to where we are. We're driving on the left side of the road. Look at the goddamn hills. Uh, we're in Asia somewhere. I'm going to assume it's Thailand. Very mountainous, though, right? Very mountainous. So I'm going to guess north near here. here. Very North Thailand. I would not assume it's in the South at all. We're like in a dome right now. Okay, it was deep, deep, deep South Thailand. <laughs> Fair enough. Wizard 101 Wednesday. Guys, if I wanted to kill my stream, I would play GeoGuessr until I got gold. All right, where are we? Where are you? Uh, we are in a shrouded forest. Somewhere in the northern hemisphere. White lady walking her dogs. Lot of shrubbery. Pretty tough to make a call without actually seeing a single car. Which is why I'm glad I just saw this car. Uh, it could be the UK. Or it could be the Netherlands. I think it might be the UK, though. I clicked off. 
We would have uh, been wrong either way, but we would have been closer. No, Wizard Wednesdays is not confirmed. I want to be clear, it's not confirmed. Tommy, hey, Lud, love the streams and videos uh, at the moment. Absolute banging content. Keep up the great work. Uh, let me say it, fellas. Has the YouTube lately been kind of shh? You know, kind of... Kind of... You know what I mean? Honestly, just going to take a stab. I'm feeling Montenegro. I actually was thinking about North Macedonia, but I, to be honest, don't know the difference. But I know it's in this area. Oh, it's just straight up Athens. It's literally as Athens as it gets. Okay, not bad. Not bad. All right. Big, long road. Look at the sky. It looks pink. It's like a pink hue. Double yellow lines usually means the Americas. We're driving on the right side of the road. I mean, this could be NA. Could also be EU. I mean, I'm going to take a stab here. And I might I might regret this in many ways. Yeah, it's like a pinkish hue to it, though, the sky. But I think we're in Argentina. Oh. You saw one guy say Argentina went for it? No! I went Argentina because I thought the sun was in the northern hemisphere, so I thought we were in the southern hemisphere, and I saw a double uh, yellow line, so I thought we were in the Americas for sure. And then I looked at the one-car license plate, and it didn't have an EU license plate, so then I was like, okay, no EU license plate must be in uh, NA or SA. And it turns out that the car was just capping. It's a drive road. Five ten. Interesting. It seems so American, but at the same time, not. It could be Hawaii, or more accurately, it is. Fuck, I'm just gonna click on Hawaii. I think it's American Samoa, but I can't get to it in time. Yeah, I knew it! Oh no, I didn't know it. I wanted to go with, uh, um,. American Samoa, but I, yeah, it's just hard to find. <laughs> it's hard to find, and I didn't want a situation where I don't click again. All right, European license plates on these vehicles. Some fences up. That sign right there, if we read it out, says something. Zaydu Salons. <laughs> All right. You guys were curious what they do there. That's what it is. Look at that art piece. That's so Ukrainian. It was Latvia. What is Wizard Wednesdays? Nothing. It's nothing because it's not happening. So don't ask what it is like it's something. It's, it's it's it doesn't exist.
This is for sure Greek. Or Russian. This is for sure Russian. Or Greek. I'm gonna make a crazy guess, like an absolutely crazy one. I think we're in Russia. But usually when I guess Russia, I guess over here. I'm gonna guess over here. I never guess the right side of Russia ever, and it often comes up, so I'm gonna go to the right side of Russia. I'm gonna stick to the left side from now on. I just, I would have been a genius if I was right and not wrong. I mean, this looks like a K truck, right? Oh, dead end. Oh, that that's what we're doing now. We're just, we're getting into dead end territories. I would never have gone Italy. Oh no, it's technically Switzerland. I'm getting boomed and lambasted by this silver crony. All right, this is good that I'm getting boomed because we have all the room for healing. As long as they don't guess really quickly, we can take our time here and really vet. I panicked. I panicked, okay? You know, I, I got stressed out because I, I was like, you know, it seems like New Zealand straight up. I think it's America. We're driving on the left side of the road, my man. I actually regret my guess. No, I don't. It's a great guess. Back in the game! Alright, double damage. This looks like Sri Lanka. Better yet. I went with the beautiful country of the Netherlands, specifically Amsterdam. We were much closer there. All right, we're on, we're on a tear. Almost captured the lead again. Don't call it a comeback. How? Because there was a yellow license plate on the car, which only exists in a few countries, but we're driving on the right. And there's only three countries where they drive on the right with yellow license plates. The Netherlands, Luxembourg, and Jerusalem. Obviously, we weren't in Jerusalem. <laughs> so, you know, you can count that one off the list. Take a stab. I think we're in Greek mountains. Um, it seems like the more mountainous you are, the more south you are. At least that's been what I've noticed. Okay, not bad. Pretty good. We're, we're much closer there, so we're going to get... Uh, a few hundred points off. That's a lead. That's a lead if I ever seen one. We're driving on the left side of the road. Seems like Singapore. I should know that flag. But I don't. I don't know any of these flags. No, this is Thailand. I think. Because the text. 
to go near Bangkok because it seems very professional. It was much more south, but still, we weren't uh, behind. We, we got some points off. I'll take that. All right. Very well paved road. Look at this road. We're in the northern hemisphere driving on the right side of the road. There's yellow markers. Yellow markers. I think that shit German. What does that sign say? Come back here. Speak Solas. I don't think that's German anymore. I'm just gonna take it. No, I'm not. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna be patient and I'm gonna wait until they guess and get as much information as possible. So we're for sure in Europe, based off that car. Uh, maybe I'm leaning towards Poland. Okay, I'm definitely leaning towards Germany, and the reason is because of all the blurred out sections. But let's go, let's go very East Germany. Oh, there's a lot of you, no! Oh, we're still in it! Oh my god, it was Latvia. I would have never... I don't know how you would know that. Quadruple damage. This is trouble. This is trouble. It's kind of do or die in this spot. Holy fuck, where are we? We're in a truck. Why are we in a truck? Th th okay, this, this means we're on an island. Okay, that's what this means. Uh, I don't know what island, but I know as a fact we are on an island because usually the weirder view So we're on an American owned island. I don't think it's American Samoa We're also driving on the left Which is very confusing We're on an American owned island that drives on the left I, I only have one inkling so it's not American Samoa or Guam, uh, but I think it could be. It could be Puerto Rico. I think they drive on the right though, but it also could be uh, near Puerto Rico. Um, do they drive on the left here? there's a way to tell if they drove on the left the u.s virgin islands i thought connected to the british virgin islands because my roommate in college was from the british virgin islands and if they drive on the left in the british virgin islands then maybe they drive on the right you know what i mean but puerto rico i think is a safer guess They got the exact same. They guess. They had to have Googled. They had to have Googled. They had to have Googled. Google Gary. Google Gary. Should have gone with your gut. I still think I would have lost because they got the exact street. And I had 150 points and it was quadruple damage. Look, I don't mind losing to Google Garys, because the only thing they will ever have in this world is that win, and then they will die. And what I have is you guys, and then I will die. Uh, we're in Italy. Really beautiful area. Polizia Municipale. I don't, I don't know where in Italy this is. It doesn't look like anywhere I've ever been. It looks more... Maybe an island in Italy? Very hilly, right? I feel like hills this close to Italy are a little weird.
All right, big construction. Pompeii. Where the fuck is Pompeii? Shit! I couldn't find it. I knew it was south. But when I zoomed in on Naples, it didn't pop up, so I thought it was in between. Alright, seems Norgay. So we'll go Norgay. Wow, I went- I literally went so far north and I thought to myself, this is too far north, Ludwig. Little did I know, it was the tip of the universe. Thailand, Malaysia. Philippines. What? I think that's Malaysian. No, that was Bangladeshian. I believe. I believe that's Bangladeshian. Because I, I looked at this earlier and I thought it was Thai, and then I lost to a guy. Okay, it was actually Laos. Fair enough. It was not Thai because they drive on the left in Thailand. Sure, you can't park there. Dude, that's not a phone number. There's no way, it's every number possible. The words are, so it seems Asian, like South Asian, Southeast Asia, but I don't know, I've seen a fair bit of English and a bit of Spanish, so I'm leaning towards um, the Philippines. Okay, I think it's the Philippines for sure, because they have no helmet while riding in a motorcycle, which is the Filipino way. It was very south, though. Not a great guess from us. Zero helmets in the Philippines. I don't even think they sell them. It's a losing business. Uh, otros. Solo buses. CL um, Colombia? No, 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 we've gone through this CL is Chile Seems like a major city in Chile I'm gonna go with Santiago Maybe it's not that major Ugh Alright, we were a little further off again, but we were correct about Chile. Fifty kilometers per hour. Europeans are looking quite possible. Northern Hem, mountainous. Alright, seems to be European style homes. Roofs. I mean, if I had to guess right now, I would be like, ah, Italy. But maybe France, too. I feel like Italians make better uses of their mountains than um, other areas. That's the Ukrainian flag, but I don't know what those flags are. Let's see one sign with some words on it and get some information out of the way. Crown Villa. Okay, that's... Confusing. Now I feel like we're not in Europe. Okay, now I'm super confused. Are we in America? 
No, because it said kilometers. So we're in Canada? We must be in Canada, right? We must. There's literally no universe we're not in Canada is where I've landed. Bruce Green. I'm, I'm going to go with Canada. I don't know where in Canada. Uh, if I had to guess. Like here. West coast. Far west. Alright, we got a better guess in. That's good. I almost don't want to move to flex how much I know about Japan, but I think I'm wrong. I'm definitely not wrong. But let's let's try to be a little more accurate, because Japan's pretty easy to get, but this seems a bit more like Osaka than any other area that I've ever been to in Japan. Yeah, I'm going to go with Osaka. Especially when she's walking around. Yeah, it was actually a little further north. Kyoto. We'll take it. We'll take 14 points extra. Did I say I'd been there? Yeah, I think I'm just more so role-playing at this point. What are these words? I mean, that seems Italian as it gets, right? Seraglio Giorgio. Isn't that just an Italian name? Zeus, isn't he an Italian god? Romania. Yes, I usually go near Cluj, although this time I was doubting myself. I have too much self. I need more confidence, man. Uh, driving on the right. Seems like Chinese letters. That's Japanese, but I don't think we're in Japan. I think this is like a Asia town in a in a different city. Ooh, this is so much information. Taiwan, perhaps? Hong Kong, perhaps? You know, I actually don't know how to tell the difference between um, Taiwan and Hong Kong. Okay, that's easy, actually. We're in Taipei. At the Shia Shu, Shu Lang School. We actually guessed in the same exact street, which is crazy. <laughs> That's actually insane. We guessed five feet from each other. I thought those were flags. They're pants. It's a bit of a game changer. All right, countries, it's not. Senegal, South Africa, Ghana, Kenya. What does that leave? Because those are the main countries that pop. I guess it could be South Africa, actually. Why did I count out South Africa? It's just South Africa. Lesotho, it was much further south in Muscle Bay. Still, we're, we got him on the ropes, baby. 
Just keep the pressure going. Quadruple points. All right. All right. That's dangerous territory. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. A drowned area. Ford Ranger. Seems American, right? 60, though. That's kilometers. Canada again, perhaps? What happened to the sign? That was crazy. Okay, no longer Canadian. Atención. Por favor. Puedo usar el Google to figure this out. A Chevy. All right, where's that sun? Okay, that gives us some good info. I think I know where I am. Last time I guessed this area, people made fun of me. So I want to be very sure before I pull the trigger, but I think we're in Argentina. Is this like a, it's been 100 or 10,000 days since our last accident sign? All right, we're going to go with Argentina. South America is what that means, maybe. It was Argentina, although a little closer to the capital. Although a lot of points. Okay, all right. If we are just within, like, a few miles closer, we're going to beat them right here. Just keep it going. Keep it going. This is a tough one. Oof, this is a tough. This is a toughie, and they just guessed. Oh, that's not good for me. I mean, it seems European. Eastern European, if I had to guess. Bang! Whew, they put the pressure on me, and I came through clutch. Back on the board. Wait, I'm popping off. We're down 20 points from where we started today. This person was fun. No, they weren't fun because they were sniping. And I don't even know if they were using the answers that I had, but they were going so damn s I have a suspicious feeling that this person might be watching my stream. I've seen this ad before. I love when Pilka guesses first. Leilai's Kyrians. I don't know, man. You tell me. Denmark? Poland? Oh, Latvia. You know, I've given up. What do you call those three countries? Estonia, Latvia, Lithuania? There must be a name for them, right? Could this perhaps be Japan? It is Japan. How am I able to just tell Japan without any information? I wish I could do that with every country. I'm going to assume this is Nagoya. Actually, it could just be Tokyo. You know what? I actually think it's more north. I'm going to go to A Amori. It was so fucking south. <laughs> I've never even heard of Kumamoto. Sometimes you gotta throw an Al Mori in, you know? I told you south? Well, I'm, I wasn't trying to cheat, so what do you want from me? I'm trying to be a respectful player here. Austria, no? AT Austria. Keep it simple, stupid. I don't think we're in Vienna. I'm gonna go to Grass. No, Salzburg. Linz. It was Vienna. Spot. That's crazy.
So far, I've just been getting lambasted. I guess it is always Vienna. Alright, let's see how proficient they are. I was getting stream sniped. GG, that was me, smiley face. Alright, if I had to guess... Are we just streaming until I hit it? That might be what we do today, boys. I might keep this stream going until I hit it. Uh, I don't fucking know, man. It's too white to be, I think, South Africa. Like, the, <laughs> the road is... <laughs> Obviously, is what I mean there, just to clarify. I feel like it's Argentina. Jesus Christ. This is dumb and dumber. We got a couple idiots in this crew. All right. We're in Greece. Let's just stick to the capitals, huh? Let's stop trying to spin up the wheel again. Let's just outside of Athens. I cannot believe this is happening to me in my favorite video game. Okay. All right. Focus up. Tighten up. Tighten up. 30 to 38. Reading the signs. Capitol Hill. Evacuation. Assembly area. It must be Hawaii. Must be Hawaii. go with with Maui there's probably a way to figure it out but I saw the road that said 30 so I went with Maui okay it turns out that it was the northern Mariana Islands 13 points easy Don't even think about it. Just snap go Thailand. Let's maybe think about this for a moment. It could be Bangladesh. Fortune favors the bowl, Sri Lanka. Love that for me. Love that for me, baby. Yes! I like feeling myself, you know? Elephant? What? I mean, South Africa is my gut call. If I had to make one, which I think I do. Where is there water like this, though? I mean, I guess this probably wouldn't be big enough to show up on the map in a major way. Yeah, there's a lot of water. Sheesh. Good guess. Good guess. Easy heals. Okay, this is a, this is a free win, fellas. Without even spinning my map around, I can already tell we are in a country. 
probably South American. I've narrowed it down to two continents. Wait! Google Street View. That doesn't help me at all. Where's the sun? Not even visible. I don't know. Brazil. God damn. Thank the lords. It was Peru. Near Lima. I don't know how you're supposed to tell that. Thin trees. Polish. I see this a lot. I'm going to go. Thank God. The moment I clicked Italy, I knew I was in Italy. His and hers. It's cute. All right, European, this time more east. I guess we were in Portugal. Was it? No, excuse me. Yeah, yeah, more east, probably. More east. Oh my god, we almost won off that? Alright, we're very close to W-Town. We are in Europe. Los Sarina. I'm getting the feeling we're not in Europe. Hear me out. What language? Give me out, give me out. A G. Antigua? I'm getting zero points. I, 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 these five, I, I don't want to play this guy. I, it just isn't worth it to me. I, I, no offense to Evan. He just doesn't offer me enough MMR. And if I lose, I lose three million points. It, it doesn't make any sense. But match me up against some golds. I'll show you what I'm made of. I'm ready for it, game. I'm, I'm ready for this. I, I swear. Anyway, I think we're in America. I'm playing till I'm gold today, baby. We're definitely in America, right? College Avenue. East Interstate 8. How do Interstate 8 work? How do you even have a number that low? That's the 10, the 4... 
the 10, the 8. Looks like it stretches across the south here. Now the question is where Lake Murray, no, that's probably not visible enough. It doesn't stretch that far. It seems like the eight bleeds into the 10. So we're either in Arizona or in San Diego. I mean, looking around, it's pretty clear we're in San Diego or California, I should say. Fairmont Avenue is the first place we're looking at. I mean, Fairmont's not enough to go off of, though. Let's Can we exit off the highway, please, actually? I need some sign, sign language. We're near a college. It, look, I mean, I guess I could just narrow this down to either U of A or San Diego State. But I need fair... What's it called again? Fuck, I have to go back. First of all, where's the 8? It's down... I just had it. It's here. This is the 8. There's San Diego State. College Ave. Isn't that what it said? It was College Ave, right? Didn't it say that? Good guess. I missed it. Yeah, hey, I was just searching. SDSU does seem pretty. All right. That's the energy I'm trying to bring here. Bangladeshian for sure. Unless it's Malay. Hold up. Let me see one car driving. We're driving on the left. Maybe it's Sri Lankan. I'm actually pivoting. I think we're in Sri Lanka now. Is it just me or, or when I'm in Sri Lanka? There's way more cool shit like this. I'm going to assume we're in Sri Lanka. And that's like the Sri Lankan, like, Kanye West or something, you know? He's a big deal. That was the Thai King. If he ever catches the video, I'd like to apologize <laughs> for calling you the Sri Lankan Kanye West. Does he look Sri Lankan? Oh, yeah. The white guy. You know what? I'm going to make outlandish calls on whether someone looks Sri Lankan. <laughs> yeah, let's play GeoGuessr in the worst way possible where I just look at someone and I go, I don't know. Yeah, they look Chinese and then get it wildly wrong. And then, the, and then it goes, bump, 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 wow. And then, and then a theme song plays, Ludwig, that's Ludwig. He's not racist, he's just ignorant and white, that's Ludwig. It's a good idea. Loves India. I don't know what to say. Something in the in, 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 in of us. Ludwig. Wait. Ludivinus. I don't know. Finland. What the hell? What a beautiful uh, cemetery, huh? I've never seen such a well... I mean, they should put these in the back. But what a well-kempt cemetery. Um, if I ever saw a sign that was more helpful than this one, I would be shocked. Here's the fuck part. 
I still don't know what this means. I'm assuming this is Latvia, and this is how you say it in Latvia. And like in Latvia, they go, oh yeah, we're Aleituvos, but we call them Latvia. Okay, Lithuania, not bad. I'll take that slight ignorance. Quick win! I like a quick win on Evan. Only 11 points. That's what I'm saying. If I lost that, it would have been 22 out. 22 out. They were showing the shape. What, did that say Lithuania on the sign, or did I just happen to get lucky that I assumed that's what it said, and it just said, like, you know, French fries sold here. Driving on the right. Mm. El Regalo Ideal SLK Puedos Eligir? My brother, I couldn't have said it better myself. I mean, hell if I know. I would have phenomenal guess. I'm going up against a real pro. Why did they guess La Paz? It was such a terrible guess, but somehow they, they got there. I saw a video of someone trying to apply for your Fortnite tournament. It's funny. You should watch it. You know, hey, maybe if it lands. If it lands on my desk Monday, 9 a.m. at the top of my subreddit, I'll have to take a look at it. That's how it works. I check out my subreddit. Even if I don't do a Reddit recap, I'm in there. I'm in the, in the thick of it. I saw everybody freaking out. Salty Ice Climbers dethroned! Everyone kept saying Salty Ice Climbers video got dethroned because it's no longer my most viewed video. But what throne was it holding? It had about as much power on top of the throne as the current Queen of England does. We didn't do anything. It's not like we did our monthly viewing. It's a pretty useless title for it to have had. I mean, I don't know, man. Denmark? Where do you Vikai? Is it flat enough for Denmark and wet enough for Denmark? And I think the answer to both those questions is unfortunately no. A14, A6, E262. Okay, interesting information here. That price for gas doesn't make sense for euros. So I'm leaning towards a, a country that doesn't use the euro. Uh, and instead uses perhaps a crown. If I was slightly more legible, I would be in. I mean, it just looks like one big N. www.rockzooms.n They fly more flags for gas stations in their own country here. Like, I'm not trying to say every country should be as nationalistic as the U.S. of A. But, I mean, we, we gotta be waving this many flags for stat oil. Wait, state oil? Okay, a state oil program. Here's the crazy thing. I'm actually gonna go Lithuania, and here's why. State oil sounds like it's run by the actual government, which would only happen in an Eastern European bloc country that was part of the USSR formally. Do they not use the Euro in Lithuania? Uh, old Glav do pee. That's what Kim K's been saying. Kucha na prodaju. Okay. I mean, holy shit. Sorry, back it up for a moment. Who is that guy? Hold up, bring me back, bring me back. This is like what Russian marketing wants you to think Putin's like. 
just shirtless and ripped and taken out trash. Blue collar through and through. We flying flags up here? How's the nationalism? Oh, we're flying our clothes. Fair enough. That bag had the Greek flag on it, but I don't know if that was coincidence. My heart says Greece now. Bambi. They just took Bambi. What a beautiful little uh, village center. Market 50 meters. That's fine. Soba noodles. I mean, the problem with guessing Greece is that nothing has been in Greek language. I'm going to go North Macedonia. Ooh, tough. It was Montenegro. We didn't do too bad. This guy's pretty good, and I've been giving him a lot of time, and he has done with that time more than I have. So I think we should start guessing a little bit quicker here. Okay, I think we are in Albania. You would think Italy, but it actually is Albania. Albania and Italy have the double blue plates, but some Albanian plates have red in them. What the hell is even this? It's a threat. I mean, it just has to be Italy, right? I guess it could be Greece. kidding me that was straight up a roman senator what what the hell was he doing in india it's like when you see those signs uh, there's this place in, in japan where they say jesus died so you drive through japan and it's like all japanese and shit and then you go to this one small town and they're like oh yeah this is where jesus christ died and I guess that's where that one Roman senator died, was in India. Imperialism? I don't think they got all the way through India. I mean, I guess they definitely did, right? I, I, I can't tell you what the Romans did or didn't do. Um, I mean, Australian, perhaps? Malaysian, perhaps? Thai, perhaps? Probably Singapore. Singapore has very unique signs. They have weird kerning. You know when text is weirdly spaced apart? Their kerning in their signs is so... Um, I, I think shit. Okay. Bit of a dead end. Probably Europe, right? Just because the cross... I think it's like Vienna, Austria, maybe. Dot PL Poland. Let's just go straight to Warsaw. Oof. This is a competitive one. <laughs> uh, we are what we're at, triple damage right now. take a stab, kind of get them on their feet, get them a little nervous here. Fuck. We lose on that. We lose on that for sure. Yeah, tough. 
Switzerland. I don't think I know Switzerland. Oh my god, what a fucking cracked silver guy. I feel like I had amazing guesses. I hate playing low. He's probably smurfing. All I, look, all I gotta say to you guys is if I play this game offline, I crush every silver. The silvers I play are absolute fools, and then I hop on stream, and the same time I hop on stream, I look at my chat, and there'd be people in chat being like, I just hit gold, smiley face, lol, tee hee. And I feel like the moment I play this game is, is when you guys are like, oh, time for me to start playing this game. And I and I get the and I get the snipers and the Googlers and I'm sure there's some good people too, but but they're not bringing us all, you know only the good players. I have no clue. What do you want from me? If I've ever seen a Hungarian area, this is it. Okay, it was Estonian. I think you're just a silver player. Okay, that was the most insulting thing I've ever seen, ever. Tell you what, I wasn't guessing the island off of Estonia. I like a quick match, huh? This is just no holds barred punching each other out. I'll, yeah, I'll turn off the song after this one. Not the UK LOL. Well, don't you look dumb. Don't you look dumb. Everyone point and laugh at A underscore H underscore 313. Uh, look, you could have just not said anything, huh? You ever think about that? You made yourself look like an idiot. There were thousands of people watching who thought to themselves, I don't think it's the UK. But they were like, yeah, I'm not confident enough to say something about it. But you were, so now you just look like a fool. Rather than a skeptical viewer, which is pretty normal. Uh... Yeah, I'll bite. Albania. You know, I, I thought about Albania, but I chickened out and went Italy. But I went to the right side of Italy because I thought it might be Albania. And this is closer. Yeah, 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 yeah. Doesn't really matter because it's a heal round. We do get a thousand. That's pretty good. Okay. Interesting. Let's drive this way to pass this car. All right. If I was really dumb, I would probably guess anywhere that's not in the UK. But then my name would be AH313, and I'm not that. Isle of Man. Is Isle of Man not considered the UK?
pulled up. I'm Googling. Isle of Man is a self-governing crown dependency, British crown dependency. Well, what the fuck does that mean? So they're run by the queen, but they're not the UK? ID. What is ID? I, I don't know any country except for Indonesia. Oh, well, fair enough. It's Indonesia. Is Isle of Man in the UK? It's not! Oh, fuck. It's the worst day of my life. We're driving on the right with giant buildings. This building looks cool. Be so bad. Gelder Mitterfeld. Gelder Icky L Motorwagen. There's a lot of Motorwagens here. A G, a J makes me think of a Nordic country, right? Like a J, like as the second letter. Okay, uh, never mind. Now I think I know where we are. Oof, oof. That's a that's a killer. That's a killer. Good night. Good night, 1.5 miles away. Oh. Get me back to gold. And when I say back, I mean to gold the first time in my life. The 95 North in Mexico. Let's try to find the 95 North, huh? There's the 85. Now we're getting too high. 150, 70, 97. No, sir, looking for 95. Forty fives. The hardest thing I ever had to find in my life. What's going on here? There it is. And then it's near Oh, look at that. Chilpanquincho is north of us, so I'm just gonna assume right here. Love that. Love that. 1.3 miles away. Can't do better than that. I hate to pee so bad.
what, what is this guy doing? If I was somehow closer while peeing during that entire round than this guy was with a full extra minute, like, then I'm definitely just not in silver. Like, I'm a gold player. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. You know, I'm going to call that cheating, actually. Were they just watching the stream? Like, hey, I wonder when this guy will get back and waiting to guess what's going on with this. They really waited the whole nine yards. This has to be beautiful Russia. Beautiful Russia. Okay, never mind. Isn't that the Greek flag? Or no. I saw this sign before. It was in Lot Lithuania. The Greek flag though, isn't it? I'm so sick of this game! I clicked. I, I clicked. If you if you rewind, which is easy to do on YouTube.com. Look, 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 look. I was here. I was here. Bottom right. I'm looking. Click. Right there. Right there. That's my marker. Nothing. Nothing. You don't have to click the guest button. It's not how it works. Oh, my God. <sighs> We're going till gold. We're going till gold. What time is it? 820? We're going till gold. I'm a gold player. We're going to play this game till gold. It's 8 p.m. right now. I'll, I, look, I can't imagine this will go much longer than, like, maybe an hour. Got to be Melbourne. So Melbourne, Australia. Australia in it. Big time in Australia. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just, <laughs> it was close though. <laughs> I don't know the Melbourne accent well. I'm, just, I'm working on it, I guess. Um, Netherlands, UK, perhaps, Denmark, Norway, Reykjavik. I mean, let's just go Denmark. Let's hear your Jamaican accent for the rest of the stream. Uh, it was Sweden, but we were damn close, so that's all right. Uh, Damn. Kind of looks like Poppin' Gamer in here. This is a tough call to make. All I know is we're driving on the right and maybe Europe. There you go. Not bad. Bulgaria. Why is everyone saying Ohio? There's one person since I started playing this game like two hours ago that said Ohio every single guess, no matter what. And I think other people have just followed suit. And now that I've said that, surely we're going to have just hell. This has to be France. What the fuck? I guess I should have read the word that was French. For some reason, I just trusted the license plate. 
0.25x healing. The good news is we've done zero damage to this guy, so they can't even heal, and we have a lot of room to heal. And we know the exact country it's in. So that's all good news. We're going to be at 3,800 health to their 6,000 health. Why is my title the American Education System failed in me and now I'm hard sucks over? Obama. Holy shit. What? Dude, imagine th Whoa. I would have never guessed a random aisle on the right of Russia. That was crazy. I've never seen that before. What was that mountain? That was like the one of the prettiest mountains I've ever seen in my life. Looks like a vineyard of some sorts. Northern Hemisphere? I mean, could be like... I mean, it can't be a vineyard, right? So there's just nothing here. It can't be a vineyard because there's no grape vines inside. It's not the beautiful trees of Ohio. They love God here. Okay, that narrows it down to about 113 countries. We're driving on the right. That narrows it down to 109. Three to a motorcycle with zero helmet. That means we're in the Philippines. Okay, we both guessed the Philippines. The correct answer was, in fact, Colombia. The day it's Ohio, you guys are going to lose your mind. Because I'm not going to guess it, and you guys are going to spam it, and then you're going to you're gonna just say I told you so until the end of time. That is not a phone number. It's too many digits. It's a phone book. Oh, right. I don't know, Sri Lankan? We're driving on the left. Let's play a game. Can Ludwig remember what Thai is versus Malay versus Bangladesh versus Sri Lankan? This one's certainly Sri Lankan. No. I think it's Malay. Oh, you know what? I was wrong. <laughs> it was so Definitely Thai, but it was just really close to Malaysia. All right, there you go. I got to stop facing off these low silvers. I get 10 points for this win. All right, let's do this one fast. Let's do a speed run here. Vineyard, Italy. Call it a day. happened to the sky France no way just kidding it was Switzerland municipal de vertedro
Argentina. Has to be Argentina, because we're driving on the right in the southern hemisphere. Or Chile. That's not bad. We were pretty close. We get a thousand points chopped off on their score. Get rolled, Helen. I'm going to do a really brave guess right here. Of Russia. Man, when Ohio comes, boy, are you guys going to lose it. All right, it was actually North Macedonia, so Russia was a terrible guess. What the fuck? What the hell? Dinosaurs of Japan and Asia. Asian dinosaurs have been found from the Triassic to Cretaceous. Studies on Asian dinosaurs started in the early 20th century. Recent discoveries from Asia have increased rapidly. Many dinosaur fossils in Japan were also discovered recently. My gut tells me we're in Japan. Okay, good guess. I guess, like, more central, because, okay, this is Thai. I know how it looks now. I've actually become an expert at Thai. Oh, I could have just turned left. Oh, she didn't guess! Oh, it was a heal round. What a bummer. It's okay. Max health, that's pretty good. Why is everyone talking about Ohio? I'm Ohioan, by the way. Ohio. They're actually just a bunch of weebs. Um, I don't know. I don't really want to think. I'm just assuming we're in, like, the Philippines or Thailand or Sri Lanka. You know what? I'm actually just going to go Sri Lanka call it a day. There's no way for us to lose because we have 6,000 health. So even it ha if it happens to be Thailand or the Philippines, we'll still be in. We're definitely in Thailand. Or Vietnam. No, we're Thailand. All right, good for us. They guessed Ohio. Did they just guess Ohio? I mean, seems like the land of ire. It's too hard to tell with all these one ways. Plastic flashing. Wee glass. Oh, probably Germany, right? Okay, that, now they actually guessed Ohio. All right, Helen. All right, Helen. Get the hell out of my lobby. Get the hell out of here! It's a serious game! Oh my god, I'm playing bronzies? There's no way the game's making me play a bronzy right now. I, I wish this could be like, uh, you know... Uber Premiere, where I can at least look at who my passenger is before accepting a ride with them. I'm classist when I come when it comes to my GeoGuessr opponents. I mean, this many bikes, and this mountainous of a region, and this many bricks by the side of the road. That guy looks Sri Lankan. Anyone else thinking it? Might be the most Sri Lankan MFR I've ever seen. All these people on bicycles, zero helmets. Wait, is it actually? Wait. 
I was making a joke. I think it's actually Sri Lanka. <laughs> There's no way. I was making a bit of a meme there because we were talking about Sri Lanka earlier. It can't actually be Sri Lanka, right? Holy shit, it isn't. It was actually... What even is this country? I just dropped what might be the worst guess I have ever dropped in my life. I'm crumbling at the seams right now. That sucked. Well, I'm just leaning towards the Americas because all I see in chat is Ohio, so I keep doubting myself. This might be one of the best guesses I've ever dropped. I have all my points on win. Please don't lose to this bronzy. I guess I will lose like 50,000 MMR. I mean, we boomed him on that one. We were within like two miles, 22 miles. The comeback begins. Should have gone Finland. It's definitely Finland. Whoa, it was Sweden. I can't believe that. Near Malmo. Taiwan? No, it can't be, right? I know, I think it has to be. It was. Okay, I wasn't sure because I thought they drove on the left, but they drive on the right apparently. We have a decent amount of health to play with against Rudolph, the red nosed cheater. It's my new nickname. Thought of it myself. Took me quite a while. Um. are you even talking about? What a beautiful town. I think we're in Germany. But I don't know where. And I would like for the, the, the damn... Hey, you're watching the stream, Rudolph. Can you just guess before me, you son of a bitch? For the love of God, stop waiting until I guess every time. You know, make it at least a little bit fair. All right, DE, it's actually Denmark. I lied. It's Deutschland. Frustrating. I would have never gone Frankfurt. It said Frankfurt. Well, I was too distracted. Me! Oh my God, I'm gonna lose it. I'm gonna lose it. I'm gonna lose it. Why would you go Finland?
We're still in it. There was a giant sign that said Bolivia. What, what, the day changed? This, this is it. This is do or die. Whoever gets this one wins. I will not guess before Rudolph that filthy fucking son of a bitch won't have my free information. Dot com? That doesn't help. Move cam over minimap. Oh, what a cute logo, huh? Look at these guys. The word kennel just evokes bad thoughts, though. I feel like we should change it. Oh, look at that house. My god. Not doing too bad for ourselves, I see. Move cam over. No, I hear you loud and clear. I'm just not going to guess before they guess. So I don't need to do all that. Does that make sense? Randolph, you absolute peace. Chat, don't guess, just spam Ohio. What a standoff we have. The stream sniper refuses to guess. They refuse to take a stab in the dark until they see the information I present. This is everything to them in this moment. It's 4.5x and I have 415 health. So any distance away, if I am off by like even 5 miles, I think I lose. Alright, it's definitely Ireland. Crazy from them. They guessed Virginia. Whoa! 
They didn't even guess Ohio. Yeah, it wasn't even funny. They had a free layup for a joke right there. It was just a bad guess. Okay, where are we at in the world? This writing is unfamiliar to me. We are driving on the right side of the street with yellow twinged license plates in Southeast Asian writing. So I would venture to guess Vietnam. I don't know if Vietnam's yellow though. It might be Kim. Maybe it's Bangladesh. I actually, I don't want to take a, ooh. Wait, we're in Israel? Oh, that makes my life easier. Okay, spot on, spotty dotty, 1.5 miles away. Certainly a little bit of stress mounting, mounting in my opponent right now. Don't have to think about this too much. Pretty clear we're in the Netherlands here. Actually, Luxembourg, I capped. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's all right, though. We were closer. South America. A hundred percent. I'm going to go straight up Mexico. No, I shouldn't have gone Mexico. I, if I had to guess again, I'd go Peru. Oh, Guatemala. Okay, never mind. I'm really happy with my guess. Straight up Thailand? Straight up Thailand. No, maybe the Philippines, actually. Bangladesh, Sri Lanka. I don't know. I would assume Bangladesh. It said Dutch. <laughs> Should I have gone with the Netherlands then? Oh my god, what a guess! It said Dutch Bangladesh Bank. Oh, I missed that. I'll tell you what. This looks like Ohio. Am I not just staring at the Taj Mahal? Here's the thing about it. I don't think India is in Google Maps. So I feel like we're in Sri Lanka. But, bitch, that looks like the Taj Mahal. <laughs> I found out the Taj Mahal was actually made for uh, for one of the king's wives. After she died. But I think the guy who made it died before he ever saw it. Finally. I don't know, man. I, I'll just go. I'll just go. I feel like I should guess in India and not Sri Lanka. But I also feel like Sri Lanka is the guess.
You know what I mean? I feel like it's just Sri Lanka. I don't know where this would be in India. If I had to get Mumbai. It seems Mumbai-esque. Oh, it was actually the Taj Mahal. Wait, someone in chat said it wasn't the Taj Mahal, and I believed you. I said that's the Taj Mahal, and then a bunch of people were like, no, it's not. So I was like, oh, okay, it's not the Taj Mahal. How silly of me. How silly of me to have thought it was the Taj Mahal. Reading chat. Well, that's what my opponent was doing. Here's the thing. I'm getting mauled again. I'm going to play this off stream and record it. I'm not going live tomorrow. That's I'm not going live tomorrow. I'm playing this game offline and I'm just going to I'm just going to I'm just going to show you guys. And you're going to see it on Ludwig VODs and I'm going to go absolutely ham bone. I'm going to destroy everyone. I'm not streaming. I'm playing this game for six hours straight. I promised live all week. Yeah, and that's until I started getting boomed and lambasted in my favorite game. I'm doing six hours straight of this until I'm platinum. I, I, I'm a gold player. I'm getting put down by stream snipers, Google Andes, chat reading Charlies. It's impossible. It's it's an impossible circumstance to win. I'm a gold player. All right, well, we're in Italy. I'm a gold player, wins 50% of the games. All I'm saying is you guys, if you play this game and you go up against a silver player, they don't even understand that you drive on the left in the UK. But when I'm going up against a silver player, they're like, oh, no, not my backyard Sri Lanka. Must be Mumbai. Play Toontown? You, you're, you're smoking reefer now. I don't know where the hell I am. Iceland? I feel like Iceland is closer to Finland than Lithuania is to Finland in terms of culture. But I feel like they don't consider that in this game. I had a better cultural pick. Sure, it was technically wrong. You know, incorrect. Off the mark. Greatest goddamn GeoGuessr player of all time. I've never played someone this proficient. Ekcheni. Hey, we all saw the Greek flag, buddy. That's how the comeback starts. I've been having this thing lately where my left eye twitches uncontrollably for like minutes at a time. Does anyone know what this is about? I sleep good. I don't think I, I sleep a good amount. It's been happening for like a week. That's a bummer.
We've lost rank today. We've lost rank. Can't end on a loss. We're not even making progress. Gold win. When I go up against some easier opponents. I gotta do some studying, I think. I'm going up the against the best and the brightest the industry's ever offered. Where the hell is this? This is... Where is this? It must be like Dubai, right? Thirty-one points. That's huge. Ugh. All right, Southern Hemisphere driving on the right. I think reading this sign is impossible. I'm just gonna take a stab, Indonesia. An Indonesian stab. Oh, you just also happen to be an Indonesia, Maxwell? Well, what was Indonesian about it to you? Was there something in your in your heart of hearts that was like, oh, that's probably Indonesia? I don't even have to think about it. This is obviously Brazil. Oh, not so effective without a little bit of sniping, huh? South Africa, that doesn't even make sense. We're driving on the right side of the road, Maxwell. This is the people. This is the people I'm dealing with. Right side of the road. Right side of the road. South Africa. Impossible. Okay, well, I happened to guess the middle of the ocean there. I know where this is. It is actually in a Sri Lankan village near Gale. Fair enough. Sam, just because you know it doesn't mean you should type it in chat. You're giving Maxwell information, Sam! You don't need to say it. I, I clicked the area. I know it's Taiwan. Uh, I don't need you to also consider if it's Taiwan. Son of a bitch. Son of a 
bitch. Slovakia. Okay. He only wants Southern Sweden because someone in chat said Southern Sweden. I'm on to this guy. Chat, now start just spamming wrong answers. But that are somewhat believable instead of Ohio. And then, and then... This guy's going to get all sorts of confused. Okay, you know what? My guess was bad, but holy shit, Serbia? Okay. God damn it. There's no, no worse feeling than getting the country right, but being worse at the answer. They guess Finland. There was a Swedish flag. here. Oh, I think I lose. Oh, it wasn't even close. I think it was the, I think it was the U.S. Virgin Islands. He get dude. He guessed Serbia when it was driving on the left in South Africa, and I lost. And I lost. Flip. I want you to fucking lift your computer and throw it on the ground, and then go to your toilet and eat the shit you haven't flushed yet. I can't cover- okay, you know what I can do actually is I just cover the map in the bottom. I can't just do this. If I just do this... Then I think we're fine. At 15 second stream delay. No, my my game plan is to end the stream and then do this offline. 
We just can't be doing this together anymore, Chad. That's that's what I found out. But we'll see. Maybe I play this offline and I D rank in a bronze, and then I'm just I just have to reconcile that I'm just dog shit. That's a future that could happen. That would be terrifying. Stop molding. Molding's not the problem. It's the losing that's the problem. This guy's 504 rated. The greatest 504 rated player of all time. This guy's guessing Brazil. Where's he getting Brazil from? Going AFK for a bit, just know the next few locations are Ohio. Appreciate that. You're, this guy got Jersey literally spot, spotty dotty four miles away. He's spotty dottying Jersey? I don't know. I don't know if I can handle this anymore. It's getting to me. It's getting to me. Why the f I didn't even look at the sun. I didn't even look to see if we're in the southern hemisphere. Try moving a bit. I mean, my strat has just been to guess fast. Because the more time, the more Googles. I'm, I'm paranoid. I'm on edge. Thrown out stinkers like that. That might that might be the worst single guess I ever seen in my life. But then he also throws out Jersey within 3.4 miles. He's an anomaly. Truly the Buffalo Bills of GeoGuessr players. One moment you think they might be the best team in the world, and the other they lose four Super Bowls in a row back to back to back to back to back. To back. off that oh my god it was dot de that bus lied to me get him out get him out
plan anything else soon? <laughs> no. Move cam? No. Easy. It's 5,000 points. Three miles away is Quebec City. John Murphy, think of the membership. Almost elimination. Oh, that's it. Oh, no. Inches. Inches from death for them. Okay, let's just finishing blow here. This might be it. There it is. Bang. GG. GG. Get out of my lobby. Next. I, could, I can do this. I can just move the um, map to be smaller. And then I don't block the score. Win-win? I'm better than you. Easy 100 points. I'm kind of thinking this is Singapore. Honestly, kind of looks like Ohio. It was Slovenia. Tunisia. 100 points at a time. It's all we need. All right. Big heels incoming. Guy on a bike. Must be Europe. Probably Netherlands. CH. What is CH? I don't know what that is. Croatia? Switzerland. How? How is it? What is it? No, Czechia is CZ.
where the convention's held. Oh no! I don't think we're out yet. Southern Brazil. Love that. Love that. Get me on the board. 3.5x damage. The hell? Get me through. I can't go through. That's so cringe. Get me through. Can I exit the bus stops, please? Please, sir. Get me out of here. Get me off the bike path. To the streets! Yes! Okay. <sighs> Fucking son of a bitch. Swaggiest swagster that is almost unbelievable, but I believe it. But an impressive feat, nevertheless. No, I think I lose on that. We're in! Oh my god. Shit. That was nerve-wracking. This guy was like silver fucking 500! I lose so much MMR! Boomed. Land bat. That was a GG. That guy rolled me. How was that guy silver? Is that it? Yeah, that's it, dude. That's I, I'm never playing this game on stream again. I'll make you guys a vow right now. I think it's terrible stream content and I mauled. Chat, today I pinky promise we're never playing GeoGuess round stream again. It'll be a Ludwig VODs thing like Super Auto Pets. Do a stream ends when I reach gold. 
I think it's just harder. I like you, I guess, sir. I hate it, dude. I hate. I like it, and then I hate it. I mauled. I mauled and bald, which is not ideal ever. To do to do both mauling and balding. SAP, no shot I'm going to do it on stream. I'm too mauled, but I will do some off-stream recordings. I think people prefer the off-stream recordings anyway. I'm going to hit you guys with one of these.